I'm fucking around with mist stuff down on the bottom. And Oops. getting smacked around by fucking bug creatures. To my dismay. Okay. Yeah, they beat the Colt? Kobe? I forget who was playing. Yeah, it's the same one that you and I beat, right? Yeah. Somebody beat it the first night. They were talking about it last night. Um, There's a portal somewhere outside here. It should be. We put a portal. Uh, we put a little building near okay. the stones. Back here. And there's a portal in that building. Okay. I'm going to attempt to get to my other boat, and then I can make another portal. Oh, I didn't name anything. No, I can't. Well, one of you can help with that. All right. Hey, Marcus, let's destroy all this. I don't think anything has a statue, so yeah, I think that's very much in the realm of doable. <laughs> all right, so we portaled in. We are... In a little hut in a little village. Yeah, we're, we're in a little with a bunch of chests that are empty in a little village okay all right so when you leave that building one of the dudes that was playing is that yours that, is that yours up there on the hill or no yeah that's the one on the hill that's yours you can go claim a bed up there on the hill if you'd like i built like 15 beds so whoever randomly starts and doesn't have a home yet has a place okay and then somebody here is, looks like they're building a stone one with levels, or was that just a ruin? It looks like ruins. Well, there's a stone building to the left of where you came in that one of the three dudes built. Another dude built a little two-story wood building. Okay. I think Pete is going to build like something by the water, but he hasn't built his house yet. There's Kevin's house. What the fuck is that in the water? Oh, it's a, it's a rabbit. Is that a rideable thing? The locks? Somebody's. Is. somebody's... Oh, yeah, locks. Yeah, they come from the plane environment. So, from the planes. Um, you can tame them like I did, and then once you've tamed them, you can put saddles on them, and yes, ride them. Nice. Mine's glitching. Okay. Pet. Aim. Hungry. Lox loves you. Aw, rename. You can name them whatever you like. Only so many characters, okay. I I got me a lox. And his name is Creatures. He really loves me. I like petting him. Alright. Getting distracted. Said nobody in a survival game. Okay, let's see. Bagel. Somebody named that one Bagel. I like that. Holy Gates. <laughs> I need a birch tree. You throw berries and cloud berries on the floor for the animals to eat? Is that what that is? Yep. Oh, I must two they'll breed and make more okay they have, to have enough open space that's why the loxes get moved out of the breeding pen i have up there uh, you do have two loxes in it just so you know yep yep i keep two and then i shove the third out oh uh, okay so that is this why we have like 900 here that is why there's so many loxes roaming around being my self-defense mechanism 
Because even though they say they're frightened, they run over and stomp the shit out of anything that comes in the area. Ah. Oh. I see. Hmm. I don't know if I have fine with me. I don't feel like fighting this. I'm gonna run up and give myself some fine work. I think. Yeah, they were like, uh, it's such a badass house. <laughs> yeah, that's Kevin. Look at your potions. Oh, I built a bar for you. So you yeah, the bar up. area is awesome. Yeah, the bar is really cool. I figured you didn't get enough bar at work, so <laughs> you came home and get away from it. Yep. So, how do you put stuff on the counter? You just throw it in a lands there? No, there's um things you can place down um on the like tables or walls. So there's ones that you can put on the wall and that way you can attach stuff to it, like the trophy heads and stuff. Mm hmm And then there's ones you can put on the tables so that you can put like food and other items and such on it. Hmm. And it kinda clings to it because it's a item holding post type thing. So I put the ones on the bar shelves and on the bar itself. And that way we can display potions and whatnot. I see. In case people actually want to use them, um, the containers over there has potions people can use. Oh, okay. It's the funniest thing that Marcus would jump right in the bath. You are, <laughs> you are stinky. I don't even. Does it do anything? The hot tub? No, it's yeah. just relaxing. I think it just talks about comfort. It does. It bumps the comfort level. Ah. And then the comfort level um, determines when you. Sorry, my brain is half working here. When you go to bed, depending on the comfort level, when you go to sleep, when you wake up the next day, you'll be rested based on the amount of comfort level and all the comfort level will make how long it lasts okay so if your comfort level was 11 or something it's gonna last you know most of the day and then what uh, rest it does is it increases your stamina regeneration rate so that way you can have a bonus stam regen throughout the whole day because you slept someplace you find comfortable hmm. so let's be fair that's it's realistic right like if you had a good night's sleep, you feel like less dog shit the next day. If you slept and hurt your fucking back all night, you don't really feel like going adventuring. That's true. So we gotta jump up here. Okay. That sounds you, good, baby. Have you have you had a uh, fun building your house here, Kevin? Have I had fun building? Yeah, your house. Yeah, I kind of, I didn't aim for a generic house, I aimed for a kind of a barracks thing, just since there's going to be so many people, potentially. Yeah. Who's winning? Um, whoever has, has to stop. Probably going to be you. Yeah, m mine went down. You won. Alright, I need, I need one of you two, if you are willing. To go to the stone tower. Sure, I'll go. I, I Marcus can come to you. I have no idea where the stone tower is, but I'm gonna back of the building. I figure this out. Oh, back of the building. It, do you go? Do you access it through the building? Yeah, you can go out through like where the bar area is. There's a uh, back door that leads uh -huh. to the garden, and then there's a pathway from the garden to the tower. Okay, so this way. Yeah. I'm growing carrots and turnips back there. Nice. Show that door. We don't live in a barn. <laughs> and what I need is one of you to name one of the portals up top missed. And I typed it to you just to make sure I'm not an asshole and have anything misspelled. Hmm. I look at his stairs. They're kind of wonky. Yeah. Um, I'm guessing the portal that's off. It, it, any of them. All of them are non-named. Oh, some are. Uh, I see. I see. Okay. Okay. 
They should all they should all be glowing, but none of them are named, so they're just gonna go to each other. But I wanted to make a bunch of portal locations that way as we explore and go new places yeah. before we leave, we just name one something. And that way whenever we get where we're going, you just name it again and you'll have a connection back to the base. Oh, you connected it. I put a portal that um, made Marcus jump, fall out the house. Oh, I mean, I might fall. I haven't tested these. <laughs> oh, no, I came through the right side. I just tested yours. Yeah, this, this is the little base. I got my turnips and my carrots growing down here. I'm growing barley, but barley has to be grown in the plains. Okay. Why can't I open this door now? There we go. Marcus is flooding there. All right, let's see what's out here. So this is the mist lands. You're, you're in a black forest, but the mist isn't far. Okay. But you might get attacked by mist things. They're um, not kind. That's that's the word we'll go with. The mist is right behind us. I'm guessing. I'm picking up all the stuff you you threw on the floor. If go to your map and make sure you're visible, so I can see you. Uh, you guys always like to make sure I'm visible. Well, I just realized that I was invisible, so. Oh yeah, I, I wasn't even paying attention. That's a good point. No inventory with my wood arrow. Kevin, you just threw a lot of stuff around this house. I just want to let you know. Uh, I'm pretty sure those are all from corpses. Oh, okay. I'll go back in and I will put them in these boxes. What do we... Uh, just... There is no organization. Yeah, I'm not... Me murdering and trying to get some type of a location to sleep in while I was out there. I was like, I'm not even going to try it, so don't worry about it. Nope, nope, that is that that is a survival hut more than anything else. In case we need anything, in case we die and have to come back or something. Uh, that's exactly why I wanted to get the portal going. Because I've already died once, and I had to make another fucking boat and sail down there. And then I died again. So I had to make another boat, but I was out of the other material, so I had to make a shittier boat. <laughs> so I was like, I am putting a portal this time. And then I forgot to name it, so I was really grateful that you were here to name the fucking portal. <laughs> no worries. Perfect timing. Yeah, Mar Marcus and I put a portal up in his world the other day. And we needed it. We were fighting dragons in the mountains. Oh, the drakes? Yeah. Yeah. And we were um, stealing their eggs. That's the way to go. Those eggs are seriously, ridiculously uh, heavy. Yeah, 200 weight. Yeah, two or 300. Yeah. Nonsense how heavy they are. And you need three of those eggs to summon the mountain boss. So you need to carry them back and forth or have three people. Three people. Exactly. Every time I've done it, it's been me, so it is three trips because I can't carry 900 pounds. Let's see. Any locks is in here. I didn't put a saddle, so let's see if I can shove one of you out the door. Where did you go, Marcus? I went back to the main area. Okay. Good, I got a if we can mad cat to use the tar artography thing Op topography nope nope close to <laughs> with a c it, yeah. to plant trees mm -mm. so that way you can see the map that others have explored oh uh, okay maybe that's what it was so if you go back to the starting little village once you've claimed a bed and i still recommend claiming a bed so if you die you spawn there instead of the starting stones. Yeah, we um, yeah, we did. All right. So if you go back to the base, the little one down here that everyone's at, the bigger building that's not stone here, it's got like a forge and everything on the outside. 
has repair stations on the inside in here. I did put the fancy repairs, so if you guys bought your characters from the other game with all your nice gear, you can fix it. Which Mommy nice. Jeans never grabbed it. Yes, I grabbed some of it. But I didn't want to break the one sword you gave me because it was close, so I put it away. Well, this forge right here fixes all the higher end stuff. Okay. So I'll make sure to bring it next time. If you uh if you talk to this table, you'll be able to see on your map everything that's been explored by other people who have talked to this table. Okay, I'm coming back. Hey Marcus. Alright. Hey. We don't live in a barn, shut these doors. What? What doors? I know it's you. What you talking about? Yeah, we're for you. <laughs> Where are you guys? Outside? Okay, you guys. Oh, yeah, there you are. If you talk to the cartography table now, open your map. It yeah, I like see. That's crazy. I marked a lot of things while I rammed around and explored the map. That way, if people want to grab stuff or... Um... Did you sail all the way down into... Wow. Yeah, I had to go find some place I had missed. So I just kept going south until I found one. How big is this freaking map? Oh, dude, scroll out. Use your mouse. Yeah, I know. It's ridiculous. <laughs> you have, these like, worlds are huge. You've you've looked at so much, but it looks like you haven't even like scratched the surface. Yep. <laughs> About right. Yeah, I'm coming to America. Let's see, what does this say? Wood. Fine wood and core wood. That's all their wood stuff. Okay. That's organized. Uh, that would be Pete. Okay. Yeah. Fuck up his. That thing following you. Me? No, it's Ted. A... Miss. Okay. It gets rid of some of the mist when you go to the mistlands. Uh... You've been in here 89 days. Yes. Holy crap. I've been building, I mean, most of it's honestly been AFK while working, but whenever I'm not slammed at work, I turn around and start building stuff, and then I get slammed at work again. Hmm. So I'd say at least 60 of those 80 days have just been me AFK at the house. There is nothing new to copy. No, oh, but if you look at the map now, everything that they uh, people have seen. Yep. So if you click the left one, you add your stuff. If you click the right area where the map is, yeah, you add our stuff to yours. Cool. Who who? Map. Go ahead. Who did all the copper and dragon? Was that you? The copper and dragon. I'm sorry. Yeah, all the all the icons. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, whenever I like, if I'd see a copper node, I'd mark it. If I saw a dragon egg, I'd mark it. If I saw I didn't mark crypt or not crypts, but um, where skeletons are. Yeah. Which I should have, but I didn't, because they never respawn. Like you can never get the super cores from them again. Yeah. So I didn't mark them. I figure people can explore them as they find them, but dragon eggs will respawn. The crypts is where people get iron. So. Infested mine. What's up? The infested mine way down south, mm -hmm. that is the Mistlands um, delves that you can go into and get all the end game stuff. Okay. Well, I've only found one so far. Hmm. Map's really not that big. I was just kidding. Oh, I'm like, what I've explored isn't. No. No, no, it's, it's cool looking. Wait, wood and missile? What the heck is... Missile that can provide a tough defense against foes. Do I get like a gun to shoot out wooden missiles? Um, there's an arbalist. A crossbow. Oh, that makes more sense what a wooden missile would be for. There's also a automated turret. And I know this sounds silly, but there is a ballista you can put on your house and fill with black metal arrows. And it will shoot at enemies. And if it thinks other players are enemies, it'll shoot them too. So I haven't put any up. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> They're pretty ruthless, and I don't necessarily... like. So what you do is you put a trophy on them. So if you don't put a trophy, anyone who didn't build it gets shot at. Oh, uh, okay. So if you put a trophy on them, it will target specifically what it has a head for. Hmm. So you can put, like, graylings, and it will just go ape shit on graylings. They're really good for mountain defenses, in my opinion, because you put a drake on them, and it starts killing the airborne assholes. Oh, uh, yeah, I can see that. And it, it's not a limit that you got to keep reloading it, I take it. You got to keep making fucking scrap and putting it in there. Yep. Boy, do I wish it was on the That'd be nice. What are we doing up here? Looking at the view? I was just kind of letting you guys explore. See, that's someone else's house. I didn't want to be a dick and explain how smoke works. But like this brazier he has on the bottom floor, it generates a lot of smoke, so it floats up to that roof. This thing produces a lot of smoke, so it floats up to this roof. And then his third floor that actually has a roof has a hole in it. There it does. It does. So I just kind of let them be. I don't know who this person is anyway. I was like, don't be, be a dick, Kevin. Must be one of Pete's friends, because I don't know it, who Kruk, Kruk, Kruk. Yeah, I think it's one of Pete's friends. He was at his house, I would assume, so. Oh, uh, it's probably Dan. His roommate. Because he had, he had one that was a roommate and one that was a friend, I would assume. Yeah. The roommate built this one. Oh, I just accidentally hit your friggin'. Can you name this again? I didn't mean to. Or did I accidentally mess it up? I hit a portal. I was trying to pick up something. The portal seems fine. Okay, maybe I ba maybe I backed out right. But there we go. Let's repair it. There we go. Yeah, I I accidentally edited the name. That's what I was talking about. Oh. Um. I hit E accidentally. It said your name. It said. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was the first one I made just so I could have a village up here. Okay. So, like, these little buildings right here, like, these generic-looking ones that look like they belong in Valheim. Uh-huh. These already existed. All I did was... Go in and start repairing with uh, the hammer and replacing the parts that were already there. I didn't want to think, do anything crazy because I assumed everyone's going to end up building their own. I just wanted to give everyone a place to start. Yeah. So I found a place that already existed and just kind of repaired what was here. And then that way people could put a bed down, do whatever, and then make their own place. That makes sense. And then I decided when I was building my house, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to build like a barracks kind of thing and everyone can use it. Because if everyone actually participates that's all in your Discord or that wants to... You know, the more easy and welcoming it is, I assume, would be easier for them to want to keep playing. Yeah. So they would enjoy it more? That makes sense. Well, that was cool. All right, so what do you want to do? Do you want to build your house? Do you want to go explore? Do you, uh, what's your game plan? Hmm. Marcus, what would you like to do? He's not much of a builder. I thought he said he liked building last time we were playing. Nah. <laughs> Did you say that? Great that doesn't sure. sound like that doesn't sound like me. <laughs> it doesn't sound like you at all. I make the most basic bitch stuff. Who cares? Hmm. I don't really. Yeah, nobody cares. It's just. I kind of want to explore and see because I don't. I kind of want to build, but I don't want to screw them over there in their houses. <laughs> well, let's build a new area. I mean, you can see where the starting stones are way down south. First thing I did was build a boat and sail completely around the main starting island. Yeah. And then when I, the reason I picked my spot was because I kind of, I mean, I was being a little dickish, but I wanted to pick a dangerous area. So when I saw that we had a swamp and a plains in the area, uh -huh. I was like, all right, well, I'm going to, I'm going to pick the nice spot in between all the death spots. Yeah. And that way farming the later game or the mid-game stuff is easier depending on you know, how far along everyone is. I like that. I built here, but we can go wherever. I'm kind of... even have more fun with it. We can sail somewhere if you want. 
or you can quite literally grab a lox and we can just go ride to another location on the map that you want to build your base on. I want to ride a lox here for a second. I do need a... I have this bad habit of picking up stuff. Okay. Let's go find you guys a lox with the saddle. Yeah, mine says creatures. Don't don't mess with it. <laughs> I don't think I can actually see the... Oh, there's a lox fight going on over here. What are you guys fighting? Um, I'm running around with Marcus. Let's see. Fighting each other? You. Eagle. Nah, they, they're killing graylings and deer. Oh. Yeah, that's why we... The reason there's so many random deer parts and whatnot around, Dave, is because the locks run around and murder them. And like... then they'll tell you they're scared. They're like, ah, I killed something. I'm terrified. <laughs> they're big babies, but they hit like trucks. Yeah, mine was... Over here. Oh, yep. All right, so I got pet, I got shift. Okay, use. You have to jump up and click the saddle. Yeah, I saw that. Oh, this is cool. Let's watch Marcus get on his. Well, he keeps running away to try and kill this deer. Really doesn't like that deer, man. You're right. I'll go for this one. It's more docile right now. Never mind. <laughs> One of these will let you ride it, maybe. <laughs> you gotta look up at the saddle to get on it. You can name it. And then what do you feed them? Cloudberries. Cloudberries? Nice. And there's a box of cloudberries in the little pin up here. Okay. We can grab some before we go. Did you guys cook yourself any food before we go? Um, I, um, I don't have a lot. Yeah, I still have like so one, two soups, one salad, and one burrito still. Well, there's a cooking station up here if you want to do... All right. Inside the pen? Yeah. I got to figure out where the hell my locks is going. I told him to stop, and he just doesn't care. It's like, you're not the fucking boss of me. Yeah, there's, um, in the left crates down in here, there should be food for your locks. And then there's also, um, like, boar meat and honey. I saw honey. The cooking station's up here to cook if you want. It's, it's telling me there's so much to make. <laughs> FT station needs a roof. Okay. Oh, you're talking, you're a... You're talking up there, or are you talking down here in these chests? No, where I am. Where I am. Here. This is the uh, crafting and cooking area for my little building. Okay. It should be equipped to cook any of the meals you want. I got a club. Three racks, two cauldrons, two ovens. Wow. Yeah, I need to add fire to it. Um, I think... I have Marcus. Hey, Marcus, wait, hold on. What is a shift? How do you cut it in half again? There we go. Shift and then click. Yeah, it looks like I only have. I think you picked it back up again. I only have four cooked wolf meat. Oh, you don't? No, no, the boar meat I did not pick up. Oh, I have ten boar meat. Okay. Okay, that's what I dropped for you. You grab some honey. It's right here in the bees. You can make. Boar jerky with boar meat and honey. Bees are happy. Okay. And you make it up there in the cooking pot? Yeah. Alright. Coming back. Oh, you're so good at that. I got stuck. Okay. We have to... Go around. I wonder if we can hop up that hill. Loxes are your friend for jumping too, by the way. I saw you do it that I saw you do it that way. Yeah, I jump right on their faces then just jump up the wall. Yeah, I hit rapid jump to get up there, that's how I got up there. 
But I'm a ninja. Alright, let's see. Resting. Too far. That's a forge. I don't need that. The cauldrons are where I'm at. So if you want to make recipe ones, you want to use a cauldron. If you just want to like smoke or cook the meat, you use the cooking stations over here. So the cauldrons are on this side though. So if you've got your honey and your boar, your wolf meat or whatever the case, is. there's two of them. You need to choose one. So you need raw and raw boar meat, okay. But if you stand in the fire, you're gonna eventually kill yourself. <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize I was at my menu, I wasn't even paying attention. Okay. And then there's things later once we get a windmill and some barley going that we can make pies. And you have to put them in the oven to cook them. Okay. But mommy jeans, you didn't grab the armor that we left for you. But I left you a set in here just in case you decided to do that. You have a crafting table over here. All right, let's go to my inventory. Thank you. We want to go five. We want to go. Inventory full. What does that mean? Your inventory is full. It is full. I'm going to put a chest at the end of my bed. Good call. Yeah, build me one too. I will. Hold on. I forgot to jump. <laughs> right here is your uh, armor there, mommy jeans. Uh. Marcus, do you have wood? Oh, cool. No room in inventory. No. You don't have any wood? Hold on. I do. I have seven. Awesome for me while you sit down. Uh, there's also a chest down here, so you guys want to take and or use anything that's down here you're welcome to oh thank you just get your armor through the floor i think so god damn it i was like why is shit appearing in my fucking inventory <laughs> i'll just put random stuff that i don't really need in this that's here. Uh, you're gonna see that's all that's in here is random shit that was in my inventory yeah i'm just putting all my random stuff in your box marcus i don't feel like getting I need a few more pieces of wood to make a crest chest in front of mine, but I'm not too worried about it. Delicate blue MAGA caps crackle like nerve endings with... What is this? Is, can I eat this? How can you tell you can eat? How can you tell you can eat stuff? Bad word. Yeah, it's a MAGA cap. <laughs> Mage cap. Did I say MAGA? <laughs> I, just wasn't, did. I didn't realize that. Mute these mage caps? I don't think so. I don't even know. I think they're meant for cooking, though. I oh, think yeah. you make them into, like, different pies and such. Okay. Hmm. Okay, now, where is the stuff? Since you accidentally um, picked it up. Here is a helmet, which it looks like you're wearing. Here is the shoes that I don't think you're wearing. And here is the vest that I don't think you're wearing. All right. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for making that for me. I'll leave my bow and arrows. I got 11 arrows. Let's see. Definitely do not need a hoe on this journey. He's got hoes. <laughs> Let's see. I'm curious if I take this, if I can eat that. I'll wait. Okay, I got nine minutes. All right. Now you look like a fancy caster. And honestly, they look so much better than the female characters. You look good. That's my approval. <laughs> One of you has a hoe? Um, I just I, I just dumped it off. I, I mean, if you is if it you're a cultivator, wet, are you building or are you Exploring. I'm exploring. I got rid of my hoe. 
She was dirty. I'm gonna grab some fine wood. And that way when we get to whatever base that you want to build, or area that you like, we can put a portal up. You have to get off to feed your locks. I think so, yeah. You can just put like one next to him. Oh, I gotta throw it on the floor. I like this, okay. Or I can eat it. It is an option. You just look your hungry locks in the face, like fuck you. <laughs> That's completely what I just did. Damn it. Where did mine go? Where are you at, Metal? Alright. As I say, I have to have a cooked fire underneath it. It looks fire looks like it's there to me. You need to have a lit fire under the cooking station. You gotta add wood to it. Which fire is not lit? I don't know, they all look lit to me. They're definitely all lit. Yeah, it's not letting me do it. Do you need the meat generically cooked? There's not a recipe you're trying to use over here on the cauldrons for? Just generically cooked. Okay, let me try resetting them. Go walk through the fire for a second because you know that always feels good. I want this house right here in the swamps. You can build a swamp house. I will warn you though, you're going to be constantly defending it. Yeah, I just uh, w went down here to the swamps and I saw a house randomly. So is that what's north of us, swamps? Yeah, so if you look at the map, those like gray poop looking areas are swamps. The light beige areas are plains. The trees are dark the uh, black forests. The green areas with nothing on it is meadows. And then the white areas are the mountains. Okay. And then if you look way down south where I was earlier, you're going to see uke looking colors and dark colors. Those are the mist areas. All right. So kind of like in the mist area where you were at the infested mine, it's kind of okay. The map's covering the forest. Never mind. Answer my own question. And then up here, up north, if I keep going up north past the barley farm, did it go back to meadows again or no? It, you'll hit ocean because you can see on the map. Oh, okay. It's more if there's ocean on the out. That makes sense. Okay. Not a lot of meadows around us, just where we're at. Correct. Okay. So oh, that would mean I would want to build around this area. We could build anywhere. So, I mean, there's a lot of meadow area down by, like, where the starting stones are. Uh -huh. See all those green area that's down there? It all depends. You can put your base wherever. I mean, we can even go to a different island. Like, this is just one of however many islands are on this map. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, I don't mind exploring. I hear uh, navigating a bow sucks, but are you, mean, are you a pro at it? Fuck no, but we can have fun with it. Yeah. I wreck it all the time. Where's your boats at? The way down south. So we're going to take a portal. Oh, okay. Let me then. We're going to take that portal that you uh, you named for me. All right, then let's uh, screw you, locks. I don't want to be on you. Yeah, stupid locks. You're you're fun for a second. But now you're just stupid. Yep. The and you why don't you name the portal that's next to the mist portal uh, another name for you or uh, something for you and we'll put up another portal when you uh find a place you like. Alright. Oh that means I can't take metal. Do, do, do. That's All right. the metal. Is there a place called the Wetlands here? The Wetlands? I don't believe so. Okay. How many does it take to make 20? I didn't mean to do that. Fat finger ram.
Okay. Named it Creatures, because uh, now we know where my house is. Okay. Yep, I'm going to go grab some fine wood. I mean, we might as well rest. It's already night. That's fine wood, and then we can head on out. Have oh, you need, you need me to rest too, huh? Okay. We all, I mean, I'm not at my bed yet, so I'll, I'll head back in just a second. I was headed towards a portal because I thought that that's where we're going, so I'm gonna come back. Resting. Bed needs a nearby fire. Uh oh. They're not a fire near your bed. No, is that like a torch? Oh, all the fires on the outside are put out. Shit. Okay, so I need to get wood. Let's see. Generic. How much uh, wood per fire? One? I don't know. We'll find out. Let's just go fill them. Yeah, I, got, I just grabbed eight. Your bed's on the far side. Yeah, the last two here. Careful, Marcus. We know you like to sand in fire sometimes. <laughs> uh, it's like you've been gaming with me forever. I'll close it for you, Marcus. I know how you are with those doors. Well, you closed <laughs> it on me first. <laughs> same, 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 same. Oh, let's try this. Oh, I can finally sleep. Is it going to give me some weird cryptic message, like always? Yeah, it was weird how we couldn't get in earlier. I think he changed the password back to password, or please. Mm -hmm. Just have some alone time. Mm -hmm. I'm alone now. Day 90. All right, let's go. He was like, oh, Marcus and Dave are on. I'm just going to change the password real quick. I was playing a tabletop. I wasn't really paying attention to anything. Well, that's okay. Thank you, Kevin. See, he, he's really bad at that. Well, I didn't get a chance to close it. I'm just watching mommy jeans fall down. That was funny because I think he was trying to shut it on me. Maybe. I've game with you a lot. I know how you are. Oh. It's this corner. Yeah, I, again, the, these stairs are not my best work. I like them, though. I thought I did. I'm going to do more stairs. That one's creatures. I think it. You changed the mist one to creatures. Did I? Yeah. Oh, let's change it back to mist. I know. I just put this one to mist. It's fine. Okay. We can only have two though. The problem is like once you start renaming them, they might not connect anymore. Uh, okay. So that's weird. I guess. I guess I didn't see the name. Oh, because I keep looking at unconnected or connected. Okay. Okay. So this one's unconnected. Well, that's less good. Um, that is. Oh, it's because I put mist. No S. No S. Okay. See if it connects. There we go. All right, cool. I just canceled. You're good. So as long as you know the spelling of yours, we're fine. Because then we'll make your other one. We'll connect it via that, that name. Yeah, creatures with the uh, capital C. All okay. right. We will have to go back to repair our shit. Because obviously, wherever we have the uh, repair place. Uh, there should be a boat down the hill. Because the only three boats that I've made are all fucking here because I kept dying like an idiot. Number one cause of death, forgetting to eat food. Since that's your HP pool and things out here hit hard, if you forget to have an HP pool, they don't give much of a fair warning. Here, Marcus, why don't you... What? Take these. Did I pick them up? I didn't mean to. You, no, can, eat, you can eat them. Where did Kevin... Oh, he's down here. Oh. I missed the explore boat. It is I my boat full of food. I missed the um, mace that you built me. The mace? Oh, uh, you, you left it? Yeah. I forgot to go back upstairs and grab it, even though we were up there resting. You need it? 
No, I have the sword. I should be all right. All right. I just, I just have my sword too. Got a couple weapons on me. What are you trying to use? Not nothing. I'm fine with the sword. I usually try to be somewhat flexible in my gearing options because I don't know what's going to be beneficial for me versus that moment. So I brought a bow and arrow, I brought AoE, I brought sword and board, and I brought spear. All my jeans is kind of hurt. He's throwing this rock at you. Can, can we swing at him outside of the water or am I going to damage the boat? You could hit the boat. Okay, I won't. stuck in the water like a champ or I guess you're gonna have to help him steer what I'm gonna sit here and enjoy it I figure that's what you wanted to do you're standing right there you're the one that wanted to go on a boat I definitely want to be on a boat he's pushing us out to the water you need help Kev no no it's just turning in the big boat sucks Okay. The little boats turn fine, surprisingly, but I mean. Big boats are faster. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. By leaps and bounds. But there's a reason I like to break my boats on accident. So there's a repair station literally right behind us right now. So that way, before we leave, I'll hit it with the hammer and now we're a full again. <laughs> All right, Captain. Where am I steering ye old boat? Tell us, Marcus. You're the captain. We're looking for your place. I don't mind. I'm just sitting here. Forward. Let me look at the map. We're succeeding at forward. All right, now go left a little. And we'll continue forward. They win. I'll let you know. you hit rough seas out here yeah okay good what about octopuses or squids no but sea serpents yes do you have a bow and arrow i do what about mermaids no mermaids what kind of viking ship has no mermaids go go, go right a little bit I, I was in the map too long right there good is that boats over there or is that to the left so there's my boat to the left, and there should be another mid-sized boat somewhere to the left. Oh, no, I mean, like, kind of in front of us to... Oh, yeah, formation. rock formation, probably. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. You see you see that clump of mist over there? Yeah. That's that's how you know you're entering, like, the mistlands areas, because they look like that shit. Okay. It looks like there's a mountain in front of us, so a little to the right. We'll avoid that mist area. Does that look like a mount mountain range up there, or is, am I seeing things, Marcus? Mm, they're, they're either clouds or a mountain range. I don't know. I mean, it looks like... I mean, one of them is moving, the other isn't, so... Looks like in the distance there might be a big hill or a mountain. I, yeah, I agree I, with that statement. I think you're is right. Is that what you're aiming at? Yeah. All right. Let's go that way. Make sure you eat. Don't want you to get hungry. I'm gonna turn us a little to the right and give us some wind. Yeah. So we're not moving at fucking slow pace. <laughs> no worries. Everywhere I want to go is always into the wind. And it's like, well, I'm just used to moving at no pace. Always. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's look at the map. So that looks like a plains that coming up on our right. So I'm going to veer a little bit away from it because planes have things called death skeetos. Nice. Okay. Oh, I forget I moved my... All mosquitoes, death skeetos. Yeah. They're not afraid to uh, fly away from the island and come and murder you on your boat. Oh, nice. 
That sounds like fun, and then you have to come get me. And when you're playing by yourself, the, the answer is uh, build another boat and try to get back to your corpse. That's why having a second like set of armor or repair set and stuff like that to go get your main set is pretty important. Okay. Yeah, it uh, definitely makes sense. To the l our left, it looks like mist lands. I might be wrong. There's a lot of big rocks over there. But sure the hell is, isn't there? It's cool looking. Here's your big waves you wanted, Marcus. So your nice. sea serpents only come out at night or during storms. Or near krakens. But the krakens in this game are islands you go to and you jump on the back of. And you can mine the crustacean stuff, like the carapace and whatnot. Hmm. And then at some point they get tired of you smacking on their back with a pick. So they go back underwater and you better pray to God your boat's still there. I like how it's a pl plains, ocean. So that would... Yeah. Oh yeah, what? Oh, no, no, you're good. Yeah, I was agreeing with your planes and ocean coming. Is that a... So that's mist here to the left? It's looking like it. Okay, so... It, big fucking big one, too. Yeah. You wanna go right? That'd be cool to build a house right there, but you know what? I bet you can't. We can build your house in the mist. I don't think you can build your can you build you can't build your house just on it anything can you does the foundation kind of mess up sometimes uh, I mean it's got to be flat enough for you to start or you build like um, wooden poles to equal a flat area yeah I'm sure we can I think there's there's I don't think I've run into them but there's um, dwarf stone buildings out in the mists areas too so. oh that's cool no but I think the mist is fine uh, we don't need to build in it. Looks like it's continuous. I don't know if you're going to make it between these two rocks or if you need to go right. Oh, we'll be fine. Okay. I wasn't sure how shallow things get. We will find out. Since this is my first voyage. I just wanna I just wanna smack you in the head. I don't know why. Go for it. You're breaking the boat. Wasn't me, he hit a rock. Okay. It's hard to tell what's what. That looks, I mean, I know they purposely do that so you can go venture. But it, now to the right looks like all mist. Or Fair, we're, we're pretty far south on the map. This is where the mist land should be. Okay. I think if you want generic mountains, we're going to need to veer back north. Okay, so I guess you would want to go right then. Right. To go north and see what's up that way. North. Yeah. But yeah, that's why I went straight south, just looking for the first patch of mists I could find so that I could start replenishing and working on all the mist stuff for everybody. Conquer it. Work on it, at least. Do you want to try driving? Come here. Mm -mm. Grab, that, grab that rudder. I'm just kidding. I'm other than the map. Okay, let me grab this. And then use your mouse wheel to scroll all the way up. Or or just hit things. I mean, if you hit them enough, we will not make it to shore. <laughs> yeah, so I don't have to do anything. I just have to move the mouse to the arrows. That's it. Steer left, steer right. And then your 
instead of forward and backwards, that'll change how much sail you have out. So, like, if you hit backwards now, since you're coming close to shore, or veer us to the left, or right. I don't know how it, it's not moving. <laughs> here, I see. All you had to do was move your mouse. Oh, I don't think we're going to make that. That's my house right there on this little piece of land. So this is the planes. Okay. Let's, let's see. All right. We still have to go north. A lot more. All right. So really just to the right. So, but yeah, th this is the planes, or at least the beginning part is the planes, because you can see it's all planes like. It also tell you in the main part. That's silly. You can't put a workbench on here to repair stuff. No. I mean, it, it's there on purpose, so that way you can't just infinitely survive on your boat. Like, you gotta be careful about where you're sailing and not hitting shit. Thinking of the ocean, like, if serpents hit you, they hit you for like a fucking hundred. Do they, um, you build a shelter on here? No. Nope. Okay. Now there's, again, the whole mods thing, right? I told Marcus about, I think my favorite mod, or I think I told you about it as well, is the raft one, where you can actually build a raft and then build your entire base on it and kind of explore the seas. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Hey, you make it... Fan of that one. You make it turn so easy. I was just turning the mouse and it wasn't... Do I have to... No mouse. It's your A and D key. Oh, I was... Because I was pointing in the direction of the mouse, I thought the wind was just taking us. That makes more sense. Okay. A and D is your right and left of your rudder, Makes and then sense. your W and S lowers and ups your sails. Oh, okay. And then you'll see on the right-hand side, there'll be a little wind gusting icon that tells you where the wind is coming from. If you sail into the wind, your sails technically work against you, so you'll want to lower to one sail, which is you rowing. That's all it is. Okay. And then if you have, like, um, a lighter color sail. Mm -hmm. It's just, just a bay. I don't see an outlet. Um, then you have wind you can use so you can open up more sail. If you ever get the actual wind behind you, you haul ass. Hey, look, a death mosquito behind us. I'm looking. I don't see it. behind us, kind of in the fog at the moment. You get a little used to seeing them after you've been dead by them a couple times. Hmm. You kind of get a little paranoia spotting flying shit in the planes. Hmm. But the planes ha used to be the end game. Oh, uh, okay. Death mosquitoes, loxes, um, goblins are the creatures that live out there. Oh, and tar. There's tar as well. That looks like a little mist land area, doesn't it? Yeah. Especially with those rocks again. So we'll have to keep going. Yeah, you're going down south again. Yeah, we're going around this bend. But yeah, so there's there's those in the plains. The Mistlands has all kinds of weird shit. It has ticks. It's got fucking bug creatures. Um, they have made a carapace. It's got flying, like, weird-ass balloon bug creatures that spit fucking... Acid lava at you or something? It's ridiculous. Huh. And I'm, I'm guessing every region, the creatures, the bugs, the enemies get harder? 
Yeah. Am I fucking trapping myself? Yeah. We might be. Yeah. It's a dead end again. I think you just turn it or all turn it completely around. Try it. How hurt are we? Now yeah, we're doing all right. What is that noise? That noise doesn't sound good. What noise is that? Yeah, I don't know what that is. I hear it though. It sounds like electricity or something. I don't see the flying bombardier creature yet, so that's good. No bugs are currently flying over to murder us. The behind us, I guess that's all missed on both sides. Okay, I just saw the sun setting up. I'm a little piggy. Why is this? Because this whole journey I've eaten like nine things. You'd assume the deer and boar meat would fill me up. I'm gonna have to poop soon. Right off the end. Or on Marcus's head. Don't do that. Sounds like a shitty situation. We can push him overboard. He can clean up. I watch, uh... I watch a family that lives on a sailing boat. And, uh, they're raising their kid on it, which I... I think it's interesting, like, the social effects that kid's going to have to suffer later in life. Yeah. Not being around people. Well, I mean, not being around other group besides... They have random people that kind of sail with them occasionally. Mm-hmm. But she has, like, no interaction with other children. Like, there's there's got to be some type of detrimental gain from that. I mean, a lot of positive gains, too. Like, she's obviously not going to be fucking scared of the water. Yeah. She, she literally was born in a hospital, then they kind of got right back on their boat, and she's lived there her whole life, so. She's also not going to be afraid of people of other cultures, because they constantly sail to different countries. And they live on the ocean always, so. There's gains for it, too, but the yeah. whole not interacting with children thing, I'm curious about. <clears throat> but to get back to the point, though, like... Afraid of nudity and shit like that is also not going to be a thing. Because, like, her mom commonly sails topless. Well, I was going to say before you even brought that up, the, the sexual aspect when you are maturing. Because I think social uh, signals and clues, rela relationships, and what to fear and what not to fear. Without a doubt. But also trying to understand your own emotions, your cravings. That will be interesting. But yeah, I mean, they post their shit. He's got a really nice boat set up. He used to be a software analyst before he decided he wanted to do this. Okay. And he kind of sold his house and shit and bought a really nice boat and refurbished it and kind of self-taught it himself how to be fucking a diesel mechanic and et cetera, et cetera, just so he could fully function on his boat hmm. right? yeah he put up a satellite um piece on the front of his boat he's got a raft he's got a full setup and even more so like he took the extra precautions because he assumes worst case scenarios yeah so he's got like five ceiling bulkheads on his little sailboat that way if there is a hole he can port off that part of the boat and still hopefully get home He, he took a lot of precautions to try to survive realistically. He owns his own scuba gear. He does his own bottom boat cleaning. Like, they've had their anchor get stuck before, and he just swims down there in his scuba gear to unstick it. Like, they've gone through training to how to deal with specific, you know, sea creatures and whatnot. It's, it's interesting. They fish for, you know, fish all the time to try to supplement some of their food. They thought about it long term. They've got a great setup for it. And they post their videos all the time and they get crowdfunded as the only way they can really proceed with it, right? 
because there's still costs in food and etc. Neither one of them work, so. So they're they're on YouTube, I take it. Yeah. Yeah. So they're they're getting ad revenue to live their life. Mm-hmm. Sailing. There's um. There's a gentleman who's I think he's from New Zealand that I watch sometimes, and he will go on a four day journey on his boat, and he'll live off the land or the ocean. Mm-hmm. Depending on where he goes, and just how like countless the sky is and the ocean can be overall, and it's 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 I get what you're saying, and then we also had customer a couple years ago, probably like four or five years ago. He was um, from a different country. He was from America. They were married. They had kids. He ended up doing the same thing. They sold the house, and their kids were, I think, like four or five, and they were traveling all over the world on a boat. I think it's really cool. I'm just curious. I mean, I guess I'm weird because I think of the other things, like you know, the like you brought up the the sexual aspect of the post. Kevin, we lost you. Can you hear him, Marcus? No, I can't hear him. Can't hear you, Kevin. It just all of a sudden cut out. Yeah. If I... God, right when it was getting good. Yeah, my bad. I wandered into the kitchen. My headset said, <laughs> fuck you. That's okay. I heard the boop, 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 boop. I'm like, oh, I, I know. Fuck you, headset. Yeah, we didn't hear anything. No, I think I, I think the other aspects are going to be interesting to see how they have to deal with it in life. And don't get me wrong, there's too many things that we would and wouldn't like that that would never be a thing for me and Jesse. I love the ocean and I think it's super cool, but there's way too many things that she would not be okay with for that to ever be a thought. I think I'm with uh, Jesse on this one. Yeah, I, I, I think I would, I don't know, it builds character and it would make you, like, you know, if you're, something happens and you can be hands-on and fix it and repair it and you have financially have the money for it, but like, you know, what is it called? Is it a capsize when you flip over? Mm-hmm. That, that would be scary. Fuck yeah, it would be. In the middle of nowhere and you don't know really how to navigate the storms. So a lot of the people, when they get started, because I started looking into it, because I'm, I mean, I like the ocean. I'm intrigued by it. But Jesse, it's a, it's a no-go. And before you do any, any transatlantic, Pacific, big sailing, they recommend you be through on someone else's boat for a while. Get used to what needs to be done, et cetera, et cetera, living in those kind of environments and build your skill level before you decide to go out and do it on your own. Which, to me, makes sense, right? Yeah. <laughs> now, they still recommend you you can have your own boat and sail in lakes or even bays or oceans, but crossing big, big seas is where it gets interesting because a lot of people think about like, well, it's nighttime, we'll go to bed. Well, when you're on a boat, you kind of live on shifts. Because if you're traveling anywhere, letting your boat run amok on its own at night is dangerous as shit. Yeah. Get used to running red lights so you don't kill your night vision. Because a lot of people don't realize how just black being out on the ocean is with no light. I mean, just solid fucking black. There's something in the water moving behind us. You're just trying to, you're just trying to scare me. I was like, am I, am, I, am I weirding you out? But yeah, no, I mean, the ocean, seriously, like, if, have you ever been out on the ocean, Dave? Or Marcus? I have. I, I've been on boats before. Um, okay. Like, what do you mean by in like out on the ocean? C- cruise, uh, sailing boat, anything? I don't think I have really. I've been on like ferries, but 
you ever seen the ocean at nighttime? Yeah, I mean, I I used I live in California for a while. Oh, there you go. Yeah, and I live just, on the East Coast now, but does the but empty I, blackness? Yeah, the empty darkness that is just like goes on for miles and miles and basically forever. Yep. So the interesting part on a lot of these boats, they don't run a ton of outlying lights on these houseboats. Like, they have them, but they're just not always on. No more than, like, the generic running lights. So a lot of the times, you'll see, like, when these people are sailing and they're talking about, like, their transatlantic visits and whatnot. There's, like, yeah, you'll just be sailing, then all of a sudden darkness touches you and you're wet. And I was, Jesse's like, yeah, I'm out. <laughs> no, darkness doesn't just get to touch me. That's not okay. I'm not okay with this. Lava? What is that over there to the left? Was that lava? And... Those are goblin fires for their little villages. Huh. That's cool. I've been trying to look around to see if we can see fucking mountainside anywhere, but... Yeah. Goddamn nighttime. And that whole blackness bullshit. Uh, not to mention mists. But I, I find it interesting. But a lot of them are not okay, but yeah. I mean, you can't see what you're sailing into half the time. They're using it based off just seriously all the tech that's on there. So if your tech goes out, get, get fucked. Can you make it through up here? Or well, it kind of looks like it extends out. I can't. I mean, I can see that in front of me. There's a thing I can go around. Oh uh, yeah, I kind of see that. But I couldn't tell if the left side of it is going to be something I can clear or not. Yeah, I was wondering if it was one of those coves again. You just go back up into it. I'm with you. I couldn't tell. Look at this. this is a little peaceful land area. Too bad there's a death mosquito right there. Sir. Yeah, right on the little corner. Flying above the top. And there's a goblin right over there. Hill huck spears at us. I see a lot of birds. Yeah, I don't see anything. Yeah, I see a goblin, I don't see a mosquito. I don't see the goblin. But I do see the birds. Can you, you can't build bridges to islands, can you? Hmm. There's structural integrity issues. Okay, so they don't have the, the poles that go deep enough in the water or go in the water. Yeah, you would have to... I mean, you can try to cheese it, and I've tried it as much as I can before. Yeah. Depending on the distance that you're trying to cover, you can build, like, either iron poles and whatnot as far down as you can, but remember, you can't pull your hammer out when you're underwater. Yeah, okay. So you have to get as close as you can to being underwater while still being able to use your tools. And then you kind of angle your mouse down as far as you can to connect to the ground. Yeah. If you can help it, what you do is you use your hoe set on raised ground. But Marcus... Raised ocean floor a little. Marcus doesn't do anything for me. He said use my hoe. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's going to work the pole and raise it up for you. <laughs> That's what the hoe's job is. So you can actually raise the ocean ground up. Huh. Uh -huh. I, I was just going to say, I think it would be cool to have a bridge over to a, a little island and have like a big, have it fenced off. We, we totally can. It just can't be super far. I think this island's happy to see us. That's a big rock. Big, big old rock. Well, I heard Marcos is the hoe. Oh, Mark, he has to go dance on that. Go oh, dance on the rock? For you. Yep. That's the planes over there. What's over to our right? Still planes. Okay. I was expecting, like, a lot of dirt, but... Planes used to be in-game. All right. Such a big map. Okay. I like the asses we're making in the on the map. <laughs> I got a gut. How long did it take you to journey down south? A while. Yeah, I can tell just how long our journey. I mean, we got a little decoy back there, but 
detour, I meant to say. Oh, this is swamps. There's skeletons. Ruger, skeletons, and a blob. What's the guy with the shield? Oh, Duger, okay. Swamp's bad. I mean, swamps are fine. I mean, it, every biome's got its benefits, right? Yeah. A lot of undead, a lot of leeches. Um, you'll get some ghosts on occasion at night. Wraiths. Do they have a lot of resources for building? Well, they can. So you can get ancient bark, which is used for certain recipes. Um, guck, which is used for certain recipes. Leeches, blood bags are used in potions. Okay. And food. You can make a blood pudding. But nothing. Oh, what's that little fire over there? Uh, those randomly occur. On a, a special occasion, the Ignis cores that you find in uh, Dungeons with Skeletons, mm -hmm. sometimes you can actually find the fire creatures they come from. Huh. Never kill their spawn point. Way too valuable. You want to farm those little shitheads as much as you can. Raining. But like these trees here, can you chop these trees down and use wood to build a base? No, a lot of these big, like spooky looking trees. Yep. Aren't breakable. Okay. Not all, but some. And they give you generic wood. Because the only woods in the game are core wood and fine wood and the, the normal wood. All right. Now you can mix iron with uh, generic wood and make iron wood and it is the oh there you go to the left do you see a little fire creature yeah that's what drops the circling cores that we use to make portals and forges and hill and oh uh, okay the ones that we find in the skeleton caves alright yeah that's the actual creatures they're fun so those little spawn points are actually super handy. Okay. Now I've got a little note marked on our map, so if we need it, we can come back. Okay. Sounded like, um, Neck. Are they over here, too? Mm. I don't think so. Necks are meadows. Okay. Now, there are leeches, like five-foot leeches, that will swim after your boat. All right, maybe that's... Something sounded like a neck. Hey, that looks like a fucking mountain in front of us. It sure does. The trees that we can build on? Build with, I guess? But you said you need iron. Ooh. So that's black forest, which isn't too bad. Let's see where we're at. Kind of a nice journey. The black forest and swamp area. We're, we don't have a portal to the swamp area yet, do we? I don't know if Kevin muted us. Why am I walking around all funny? Uh, you're just vibrating in your seat. Same with Kevin. Oh, you know what? I think the game messed up. Oh, um, uh, server issues? I'm not, yeah, I'm not sitting down. Yeah. There's something blinking in the top corner. Yeah, it's connectivity. Maybe he went down. But that shouldn't really affect this, should it? Well, you notice how he's driving, too. Oh, yeah. He's still rowing. He is still rowing. Yep, yep. I just got booted. There it goes. He didn't like us. He was like, bye, guys. <laughs> See you in the future. I've only got about 20 minutes left anyway. <clears throat> oh, really? I still have to cook some stuff before I go to bed tonight. Mm-hmm. That's what you always say. 
Yeah, I was thinking. What? I said I do. Oh, I was thinking maybe swamp in Black Forest area do a portal so we can port over there. Okay, are we trying to get back in? Yeah. That kind of sucks though because we're gonna lose. What would we lose? Where we were. Yeah, I wonder what. So far. I wonder what happened to him. I think it saves us where we're at. I don't know if we're on a boat. That'd suck if we're in the water. <laughs> well, luckily we were pretty close to land, I think. Yeah. Some stuff was standing out there, so I wonder if we can still stand out there. Let's see. Let's see what happens. He might have rebooted his computer or something. It's weird. He's still in Discord. Well, he just came back. Oh, okay. My computer powered off. That's what we were thinking. Yeah, we were just gaming and all of a sudden... You, you're you're cutting out again, so you must be in the kitchen. You do your thing until you come back. I'm I'm not in the kitchen. Everything oh. all right? Oh yeah, now I can hear you. Yeah, now you're got booted. Oh, Razor's updating. Okay. Maybe that's why the headset is doing its thing. Um, I'm loading the server back up now. It is up. Cool. I'm gonna use the bathroom while that loads. I'll be back. I hope that's not a new thing my computer is trying to die on. Aren't they always trying to commit suicide at some point? I fucking hope not. <laughs> it's always something new. Last time it had an issue, I brought it in because it was still on warranty. It took me fucking four months to get a computer back. Cool. Yeah, I don't I don't want to do that again, please. <laughs> Did you buy a complete build? Yeah, I bought oh. it from Micro Center. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, that makes sense. And got the max warranty, even if I pour water on it, set up. Because I assume worst case scenarios, because I own fucking cats and a wife. Yeah. So I assume something's going to go wrong with it at some point. But they, they couldn't figure out what it was last time. I kept telling them what I thought it was, because the issues I was running into... So I started grabbing event logs and video captures and everything else. And they're like, well, this, this guy doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about. I'm like, oh, okay. Fair enough. Don't you work in IT? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> I work on 911 servers. Uh oh. <laughs> it just dropped me in the. Uh oh. This isn't good. Well, it spawned me back at base. Where are you? It spawned me in the middle of the ocean. I did it. Yes. <laughs> um. You gonna look? Oh, I didn't die. Is the boat anywhere near you? Um, I don't know, but I'm about to die because I'm being attacked by. Yeah, I died. <laughs> I was going to say, let's see where it spawns me. A leech and three dragers. I lost everything. Boo. You said you like to go out with a, a bang. I'm in the water, too. Yeah, well, watch good. out, because... There's, like, some creature tree thing. Oh, those are abominations. Not only that, but there was a, war a swarm of things that was just demolishing me. So I, I get spawned back here. You guys get spawned in the ocean. And the boat, I guess, is just gone? The boat had a lot of food on it. That's, that's a shame. Oh, I died instantly. That's what I'm telling you. Yeah. That free guy. Hey, burritos, salad, and soup. And then he hit me once before my health could go back up. All right. So we were at the top of the S, it looks like. <laughs> yep. All right. Did it spawn you guys back at the inn? I'm back at the inn. Yeah. 
Take the mist portal. <laughs> I don't need anything, do I? I mean, we're gonna go get your shit. Okay. I'm gonna go naked. I've got a spare suit, suit of armor right? in the boat with me, so one of you can wear it at least. I ha I put my other stuff back on. Well, then Dave can wear it. Yeah. It's my run around and build a base armor because it gives you bonus movement speed. Yeah. All right. Food. Do we have food cooked already, or do we have to cook it? Um, I have some wolf jerky, but the other boat that we were in had all the extra food. Okay, so if I don't eat, I die, don't I? You have less HP. There's no actual dying from no eating. It's just your HP pool is like 25. Yeah, my HP is 25, so it'll stay there if I just sit in the boat without eating. Yep. Okay, th then I'm coming. I don't need food. Are you in the portal, Marcus? Oh no, I was going the wrong way. Where are the portals? I forgot already. It's up in the tower. That's Behind right. the house. Yeah. I went the wrong way. You are going to run to the water. I was. Okay, this lands. <laughs> oh, okay. So that makes sense. So items have forks next to mean you can eat it. Yes. I did not know that. Secret trophy and a... Okay. Wait. What are we waiting? What's up? Why can't I find the missed one? When you go up the stairs, it's to your right. It's the second one. that tag I got distracted by picking up things I haven't picked up so I can unlock new items I'm not worried I'm just hanging out at the boat until we're ready yeah I'm there I'm, I mean I'm coming I'm definitely not there well now now I don't know if I can trust you I feel like I'm just in a, a wall of emotions here I don't blame you is he here is he not here I'm here I'm picking up blueberries just in case, just just in case. Blueberries are good. Those are food. Yeah. Uh. Here, electricity. I think you might be having a stroke. I might be. What is it you smell when you have a stroke? Toast, I think, is what they toast. say. Oh, you're in this boat. Bird toast. I'm ready. I brought the spear that you gave me the very first time. Oh, go check in the uh go check in the boat. I've got my spare set of gear in that boat. Uh would it be the cloak, the hood? The coat and the leggings. Sure. Toss awesome them on. Is it Fenris stuff? Yes. Yeah. And then a fe run around stuff. Oh, uh, and the feather. Okay. okay. Cool. Not even the giants of old could weather the poisonous bites of this weapon. Take any of the weapons that are in there, too, if you want. 
Like I said, that's all spare stuff. I just like putting them in my inventory and going, you've unlocked. Whoa. I should grab the bow. Because if we get attacked by a sea serpent, really the only thing you can use. And when he's out of there, Marcus, I'll throw some wolf jerky in there. You guys can grab some. Uh, I don't have arrows, so do I need the bow? Yeah, because I'll put arrows in there too. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I didn't hear that part. I guess that was 11 arrows. I didn't realize that. I took the butcher knife. Did we just stop for no reason? No, you're. we're still going. It's interesting. Really quick. <sighs> like faster than I felt like we were going before. We've almost got um, Tailwind. Hmm. Ooh, look over there. If I just took over their little village and... Uh oh, I fell out of the boat. Just stop. Hi, Marcus. We'll see you later. We're in full reverse. This is as slow as I can make it. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Hurry. Stop. Yeah, no. Hurry. He's, He's dead. Yeah. How do I fall out of the boat? <laughs> How's that even possible? I was you, standing right where Dave was. You hit a wave? Did Dave push him off? No, I, I wish I did. Hey, it's on vid. It's on video. So I'm sorry, guys. Why are you sorry? This shit happens. Can we grab his stuff? Yeah, if you can. He just had a clothes on. It looks like three. You just had three items. Okay. Yes. All right, we got you. We got your stuff. Ah, that's so annoying. I don't know how I did that. All right, I put some arrows and food in there. Yeah. So are you? Should I just go back to Mist? <laughs> yeah, um, right. Well, I was gonna say we're gonna head up to where you guys last died. Hopefully, and then we'll build a portal there. Oh yeah. And then you can be at your other shit. Oh, okay. Well, then that works because then I can be here for the portal. Uh huh. Oh, we were killing wolves. We can make wolf jerky. I forgot about that. All right. A little bit of wolves, a little bit of honey. Yep. Nice. Good to know. We didn't have honey. That was a good idea. Right up there. Make a portal. You got all the stuff for the portal? Yep. Okay. He's so smart. No. No, I just die a lot. <laughs> <laughs> This outfit's really cool. Yeah, I figured you'd like it. You run fucking fast, so be careful, though. If you're not used to it, you'll, uh... Kill yourself with it. Alright, I'll sit down, then. You can hold the mast if it makes you feel manly. Ooh. Yo-ho, yo-ho. Gavin steering the boat. I like how you have a butchering knife in your hand. <laughs> yeah. Little fucking questioning if I want to be riding this boat with you. Don't worry. You're not my mark. Not today. Well, I mean, you already killed one mark. Pushed his ass right out of the boat. <laughs> There's nothing to see here. There's no proof. I don't even have his clothes anymore. Dave's YouTube video or didn't happen. Yep. I could delete it. Yeah, I was bummed we did that five hours and 22 minutes, the three of us, and no audio whatsoever. Oh, on the whole thing? Yep. We talked about so much stuff. I was so disappointed. That's a bummer. Yeah. That's all right. Marcus is going to regale you on all of his epic tales of uh, deep sea fishing. Yes. Uh, we talked about a lot of... Oh, well. 
It it is what it is. Yeah. I could just make music to it if I want to. Just uh, the entire five hour video of one song on a loop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like a like a twenty second song too, not not like a long song. No, exactly. Uh, Fever Ray. If only I had a heart. <laughs> no. I'll play the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> No, I, I, I figure I could always like cut it up in like five minute pieces and put songs on it. It'd be fun. Absolutely. Or take stuff out of it that would look good. Yeah, you can have an entire video of me standing at a forge, replenishing the coal, and putting in copper. Yeah, that see that would be awesome. I wish I was spectating then. <laughs> <laughs> All right, because you can see on the map where we're at. Yeah. But I figured since I'm not really doing anything, I'm having my guy sit down and I'm going to cook the rest of my lunch while you guys are working. Oh, yeah. Go do that and then... Sounds like a plan, Stan. You have your headset on still while you're doing it? Of course I do, yeah. Oh. Oh. You guys are all wireless on me? That's so cool. You don't use wireless. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Oh. But I'm 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 spoiled. I I shouldn't have said it that way. I do have four wireless headsets. But I have I really like these LG wired ones that I use for my Oculus and my Sennheiser. Is that how you say it? Sennheiser. Sen Sen Sennheiser, and I have those. Those are open back. Sennheiser is where it's at for late game audio, man. Yeah. These other ones are, um, I don't know the model number of them, but they're premium. They're pretty expensive, and I have them wired into my microphone, too. Make the audio sound good. Oh, yeah, because you don't use the headset on your headphones, right? Right. Well, then the other thing, too, is, is the possibility of going to the bathroom and forgetting my mics on. Wait, did we pass your corpse? No. Okay. no we got a ways to go. It is exactly at the end of that, top of that S. All right, that's where I'm heading. I mean, we're a lot, we're there a lot quicker than we were before, but... Yeah, we you got fucking taking tailwind the whole time. In a more direct route as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I knew where we were heading, so I kind of tried to beeline that direction. Hey, look, the boat's there. Actually, a boat, but that that's why you asked if we were by the corpse. Now the boat's not even close to where we were. Well, you yep. said you died to swamp, and I'm like... Yeah. Like, there's no swamp up here. It's all plains. It should show where you died on the map. Oh, it definitely does. It's at the end of the S. So you want me to jump out and get, get this boat? I mean, am I not near your end of your S? Or is it the one... I don't know what you mean. No, you're going to keep going up to the top. Um, Because this is obviously where I disconnected. Okay, now can you see my marker? No, because we'd have to hit the cartography table. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, Marcus, can you hit that for us? Don't I, you guys have see to it, but I won't. Yeah. Share your screen on Discord. Okay, give me a sec. Holy fucking shit. How did you get there? I that's where we were. Mm -mm. All right, scroll out a little. No. Oh, so okay, this is interesting. Here. You you were having issues last time. 
Oh. Yeah, you were having issues. You said, oh, this is, is weird. Remember when you said that? I wonder if that ha happened right where your boat was. That's why we had no boat. Yeah, because, I mean, this is this is where me and my boat stopped. We were here. And I was like, oh, that sucks. And you're like, oh, we're at the end of the S. I'm like, well, this this is the end. Like, yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm hoping that Dave and I are in the same spot. I mean... All right, two boat time. Here we go. All right, let me see if I can. I'm going to try to reverse and get out of your way a little. Now, remember, if you're going into the wind, only a single up arrow is rowing. And that will give you more speed than actual sails will when you have no wind. Yeah. You see right in front of you on that island, that little floating thing above the rock? Uh-huh. That's a death ski, though. Yeah. You want to go around it if possible. All right. That means not right at it, Dave. <laughs> it, it will fly over to your boat and murder you. Yeah. So we, I somehow navigated you through an entire section of planes without me uh, being there. Yep. But like my boat skills are better than I thought they were. <laughs> I think it didn't save some of your stuff because you weren't gone for that long before we DC'd. And my, well, I remember it's got to take a world save too. So this world would have went to its last world save. So it could have been 30 seconds, at least. How long does it take? How long is the world save? Yeah, it all depends on what it's set to on timers, yeah. I see. Are you going to sail backwards the whole way? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm trying to get the hang of this. I'm not I'm not judging, I'm just curious. I was like, he's showing me up on his first time in a boat. He's just going <laughs> to reverse sail the entire trip. Because right now he's backing towards the death mosquito. Oh, shoot. The island is right behind him. No, no, no. I hit the wrong thing. All right. Well, now I got to stop my boat because I got a feeling I'm going to have to come back and get Dave's corpse. Okay. To move forward, it's not W or it is W? It is W. But so, okay. You see how that's two arrows? Yeah. Okay. Look on the right side of your screen. Do you see where the little wind symbol is where it's facing versus your boat? The wind. Yes. Okay. So as long as it's white... You have wind, you can use more sails. The moment it's like gray or black, you have no wind. You want to go to rowing, which is one up air. Okay. All right. So, okay, I get the hang of this. All right. Bye, Def Skeeto. You know how you're into the wind now? So now you want to have it set at one up arrow. Like this. Okay, 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 I see. I would also recommend using your mouse wheel to scroll out. Oh, uh, yeah, that makes more sense. You can actually see around your boat a little. So it automatically rows. Yes. Okay, so then I'm turning it. That's right, that's left, that's straight. Okay, all right, all right. You got your sea legs, finally? Yep. But this is going to take me an hour to get up here because it's all gray. Oh, there's a win. I think on Dave's map, we veered around this to the right. Because this is where we made fun of Marcus and going to ride that pole. Yep. I'm hitting something. Must have been shallow there. You can angle yourself up to kind of drag your mouse back a little and it gives you a chance to kind of see under the water a little you'll, you'll find out when you're driving the boat a lot you'll end up uh, kind of panning around a little bit to try to see the shallows see the rocks that are coming ahead of you okay so while the boat may be faster it also blocks a lot of your frontal vision yeah 
which if you ever played Sea of Thieves, makes sense. It's easy to not fucking see in front of you. Yep. But it's always good to have a crew. Uh, I mean, half the time I cruise off the boat and being assholes anyway, so. <laughs> oh, look, I'm being mocked. Odin's sitting on the shore watching me. Nice. See a Dave coming up behind me. When you finally get to turn left up here, you'll have wind, so then you can actually show me where the hell I'm going. Okay. I like Val Valheim. Uh, the um, Assassin's Creed sailing. They really put some thought into this one. Oh, is that a fish or a corpse? I think you're a fish. Yeah, there's also asshole fish besides sea serpents. Like, um, there's puffer fish. Yeah, we pa close. Yeah, we passed one earlier. What do they do? If you get too close to the puffer, oh, sea serpent. Is what the light was? Oh, I see it now. You killed it. They have some of the best food. That's where you get the sea serpents do stuff from. Ooh. Are they pretty easy to kill? Yeah, they're. Or, or, you just shoot them with a the bow a lot. Oh. They can be starred, just like any creature can be, right? So uh, an elite version of itself. A two-star sea serpent, if it actually hits your boat, it can uh, two-shot the big boat. Wow. So, um, shoot it the fucking fast as you can to get it to fuck directly off. Okay, so, yep, I remember I was talking about this, and you marked this on the map right here where... The glow, the fire stuff is, but you don't have that on your map, do you? Nope, it didn't save. Okay. I guess my thing wasn't all the way down. I saw, so I lifted mine so they don't hit you in the butt. Yep. Oh, you guys are almost to my corpse. We're trying. Straight ahead. Yeah, it gets shallow over there. I think we went. It does. No, it doesn't. I was trying to swim. Okay, it doesn't go shallow. But there's a. I made, I made it to a place where I could stand, but then I got swarmed by five creatures. Yeah, there's a big tree guy behind the brick building here on the right. Okay. And my stuff's right next to him. He's hanging out on top of it. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna find a, a safe er spot. Yep. So we can go by like that green tree that just keep going in your way then. Okay, so I get to yeah, yeah, just keep going. Like you're gonna land where right in front of you to your left. You want me to stop there? I want you to stop there. Okay. Oh god, you got the abomination's attention. And now he's next to this boat. This may be the end of this boat. Oh, I made it. Ha ha, bitch. We're going to use this land on our left to put our portal. Okay. Do we need to worry about the gold columns or what are they? Dark elves? Wait, what? Uh, dark dwarfs. Whatever. They're gray dwarfs. We don't care about gray dwarfs. We're going to kill the shit out of those guys. Okay. They're not going to hurt our... Oh, they will, but we're just going to kill them. I'm used to having a big sword. Not a spear? Does my butcher knife not do anything? Very little. <laughs> That's 
is good to know. That's well. Really? Am I gonna die again? Hold on, hold on. Um, no, I can walk through here. We fell like in this. I don't know, we, we both might die now. Because I came down here to try to help you. Get out of the fucking water. There we go. Yeah. These dagger guys. Doggers. Raggers, whatever they're called. I was surrounded by four of them, plus a, a leech. All right, I can get my. I kept falling back into the water. I get my health back, or everything back up. There. There we go. Oh my goodness! All right. All right. So. And you make a flat spot for us. You have a hoe. Do I have a hoe? I don't have a hoe. I don't have a hoe. Yeah, he's back there. No, I don't have a hoe at all. I didn't bring a hoe. That's okay. You left your hoe. All right. So we need a craft bench. All right. And this is... Creatures. Apple C with an ass. I, I don't want. I don't want to fuck your portal. Are you still at the portals? Oh, Marcus, um, right here. Yeah. Name a different one that's not named Death. <laughs> Capital D. Capital D. You get a. You got to give all the D you can in life. That's true. That one's missed. You're about to be on poison. Portal tag connected. Set tag. Forget you, butcher. Uh, butcher knife. Thought you were cool looking. Okay. Capital D E A T H. Those connected. Come on through. All right. Now let's get on this boat. And we're going to probably ram our other boat. Make an idiot. Like we do. We're going to fix both boats before I forget. Start the turning process, which is going to ram us to the shore. But that's life. And we'll push this. Right, fuck it. I got him to come anyways. He's in the he's going for Marcus. Does it show that I'm getting him? I mean it looks like we're hitting him, but I I don't see any marker. It was going down. Oh, that one missed. That's why. And that one missed. You have so much HP, you piece of shit. I deserve arrows. Marcus, I know we called you a hoe, but you don't have to stand around naked. Uh, well, I don't have anything else because I died twice. Yonder is your corpse. Mine is behind the brick building, the stone building. Probably brick. Where are you, Marcus? 
Let me do this just a sec. I'm doing two things at once now. I didn't think it was going to take you guys that quick to get there. Or I thought it was going to take longer, I guess I should say. Alright, can I... Can you place a waypoint for everyone to see? For who? Me need one? Well, I see a corpse. Yeah, mine's, mine's up here. I just accidentally removed my... Leech underneath us. It's deep. But can you see that on the map that I just put? No. Mine's Try doing a ping. Mine's right there. Ping? Okay. And is there a take all button? Yep. There's something flying around. Never mind. Let me know right. when you want me to ping. Oh, here comes the tree guy. Yeah, here we go. I don't have arrows. He's dead. Alright, Dave, you still got some things in your body over here. Yeah, like, um. I don't think anything really important. Let me double check. Yep, carrot seeds. Yeah, and a broken hammer. Okay. Okay, we're really close to mine. Tell me, Is your... let me you want me to ping it? Yeah, please. I threw it out so it breaks. You're the one in the water over there. Yeah. There you are. Come on. Get off the shore, you big bitch. Come on. I know you wanna. Or we stopped again. Okay. Now, you, if you want to put the Fenris and the other ship back in the chest, you can put your stuff back on. Your storage is full. Well... Poop. Hold it for now, I guess. Yeah, or I'd, I'd put this outfit back. Mm, that's that's a thumbnail if I've ever seen one. What is? Look at me. Look how sexy I look. Uh oh. Hi, Marcus. You're not getting your stuff. Oh, oh, I didn't know we were there. See you later. But I can't jump out now, right? I mean, I'll turn us around again. I was going to say, I think you might, you might drown. helping all right we got these skeletons walking through the water to us yeah damn it always another asshole oh what are, what are we caught on uh like a little tin rock right in front tin and Oh no, I'm looking at the wrong direction. Yeah, there's where our front is literally on a rock. And there's skeletons down there. Yeah, skeletons are fine. 
Yep, that was a big rock. Okay. All sunny out. Sun is shining and the grass is green. Mm-hmm. Way over there. What should I mean? Well, I could sit up front. This is a place where we give Marxist his corpse. Marcus, you are a pretty wet girl. Thanks. What was that? Hey, we hit nothing again. Yeah, I don't see anything this time. Yeah. No, it's, it's nothing. We, we literally hit nothing like a champ. Oh, they, they fell off. How do you get in? Ladder. From the sides. There we go. Ladder. See, luckily we were going slow enough that that was possible. I was just showing Marcus how to do it. When we were going the other one, I'm like, well, we're at full reverse. This is this is what we got, Marcus. Good luck. Uh-oh. I can't. Oh, no, there we go. Hey, call. Now you have to make it back to the ladder. Yay, what Marcus? Yay, back on rocks. <laughs> I hate you, swamp area. I hate you so much. Anything in this house? Only your butt. Only my butt. Yep, your butt. Reverse it is. And yeah, there's nothing in here. That's so disappointing. How disappointing is it? Uh, there's nothing in here. It's hitting us. This dragger guy, are they tough? Nope. That I, mean, I was just I was just singing uh it's funny you bring that song up because I was just singing the big gay owl song from the end of the movie to myself earlier. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm super, thanks for asking. All things considered couldn't be better. I'm just well And it's great being so super. Oh, you're ain't angering me. You need any assistance? I need the boat to function. Forward, back. I don't. I don't give a fuck. I push. I push in the front. You're moving me by doing that. You know what? Fuck it. I guess that would have helped. Guess what I just did? Died to a leech. leech, it looks like. Yep. I didn't know the leech was there. It must have spawned right when I jumped in. On a plus note. On a plus note, good sir. You think the server saved me? The spawn point is right next to. <laughs> That's true. That's what we have now. Yep. That is on a plus note. Okay. And that portal is called Ho? Yeah. Yes! A Are little we bit on of his body? 
Yeah. Nice. I can hold most of his stuff, I think. Uh, not most of it, but some of it. I can't swim over there. No. We, we, we will someday come back to you. I have a question. How do you work? How do you use a craft bench when you don't ever have a roof? You can't repair your stuff, but you can repair other things with your hammer. Like, oh, if I had my hammer, hmm. I think we basically ruined Kevin's day, Dave. Why? <laughs> Just making you do all this stupid stuff because we died. You wanted to go. That's that's half the fun. You wanted to go on an adventure. I know. I was just making fun of myself and Dave. That's all. Oh, you guys are fine. Note to self: Don't save Marcus. Grab the rudder. <laughs> Grab the what? Rudder. The steering wheel. Okay. Make sure it's got one arrow forward. At least one arrow, one arrow forward. forward. Yeah, once you know the symbols, it's pretty easy to. Or it's... Whoa, 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 whoa! There's a deaf mosquito up here. No, nah, it's a leech. On your side? Oh. Yeah, there is a. Le oh yeah, you said breaking. All right, I have one arrow forward. All right. Where do we look like we're caught? Get out of here, leeches. <laughs> I'm going to slowly turn this into an ocean just by digging my way through the earth. Okay, what, what do the stars mean on the animals again? One star is a one star elite, two stars a two star elite. Two is as high as it goes. Okay. And you said elite or leech? The one uh, elite. Elite. Okay, okay. They're harder to kill. Yes. Makes sense. Are we still caught? You still have one arrow forward? I do. Okay. Gotta get some stamina back as I swim around. I don't see where we're caught. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't. I don't know how we're caught. I'm trying to destroy every semblance of land around us. It. It must be here. All right, I'm coming. Make sure you have stamina. I'm not in the water. I'm still standing. Like you will be once I'm done pickaxing all this. Good call. Well, we have to come back here anyway. A rock? Fuck you, rock. Yeah, fuck you, rock. Yeah, fuck that rock. All right. Now. We go backwards? But it does still seem like it's on this side, right? It does. Oh, it's right here. Really? It was like under the boat. We couldn't get to it. That's just going to break the damn boat.
find out. Cleared most of the way behind us. But I'm pretty sure I got us caught again on this this infinite rock. <laughs> The one rock to rule us all right here, Jesus Christ. I like how everywhere else is a swimming scenario, except that one rock. What's up, Mike? What's up, guys? Well, yeah, welcome. Hey, Mike. You gonna come join us in getting stuck on rocks? Uh, maybe. Downloading it real quick, I haven't played. Yeah, it's like, what, a gig? Yeah, it's like three yeah. gigs at most. Point eight, yeah. Why are there so many le leeches in here? Get back on that steering wheel, Marcus. Oh, alright. We will eventually, someday, dug a Panama, Panama Canal. Yeah, I can turn the boat like this, look at that. Can you go backwards now? No, it's still not moving. Wait. Where's this boat coming from? Oh. That's Dave with the assist. The very <laughs> aggressive assist. But it did work! <laughs> Alright. I got tired of you guys digging over there. We went the redneck route. That was awesome. Um, any, uh, any things in there I need to worry about? Probably. One less now. Oh, now that you moved us, where's that fucking rock? I'm destroying it. Right here. Peach shit rock. Okay. Alright, you got so much stuff in this one, too. Let's see. Isn't that the, the whole Boy Scout motto? Be prepared? Mm-hmm. All right. So that was um, something. <laughs> that took forever. I loved it. <laughs> You're going to watch your video clip. Did you guys just spend like an hour dying and not getting your body? Shut up. Are you guys both on that boat? We are at the moment. Did you try going right through the area where we got stuck in the whole time? Yes. Did I finally break that piece of shit rock, it looks like? Yeah. Yes. That's satisfying. Alright, where are we going? I'm gonna get Dave stuck first. And then we can go wherever. We should probably go to that craft bench over by the portal to fix our boats that we Fuck directly up. Yeah. I agree with you. By that I mean, again, get Dave stuck. That's my goal, right? <laughs> there we go. Succeeded. I have somebody's bow. Yes. Marcus, give us a hit. Alright, I gotta turn around. I don't like driving around at night. The animals? Creatures? I know, I see them on my boat. Did we get stuck again? I, I wasn't kidding. I told you I was going to go get you stuck. I yeah. succeeded. You totally did. Where's this creature at? Kevin, you really got it stuck. I'm on my way. I'm not good at this. Uh, you'll get it. Don't worry. 
You just don't want to ram us like I ran you last time, because it's on the right side this time. Try turning us um, to the left, Dave. I, I, yeah, yeah, I will. I was in my menu looking if I had a hoe. Turn us to the left. Wait, you got a hoe. Tell Marcus about your hoe. Marcus is my hoe. That's crazy. Uh, yeah. He wasn't even here for the whole conversation. No, I'm not even streaming, so he has no idea what, that you are my hoe. To be fair, he didn't apparently need the info. He already knew. <laughs> I no. think I just got myself stuck. <laughs> You're not as bad as what Kevin did over here. Oh, man, I'm like I said, I'm, I'm infamous at, like, is that a rock? All right, I'm going to go right over it. Not only over well, it. Okay, here's the problem. Is these leeches just pushed me more onto a rock? You hit us from the side. We're good on. No, no, no. I'm being. I'm not even in my boat. Now you're in. You're in it. You just swam right past us. No, I'm in it, but I'm not. Oh, that sucks. I can't use my sword because it's too deep. Okay. Sorry, guys. Or what? Hey, Marcus, everything sp uh, spawned back over there by you, so be careful. I don't know what this is, but it's about to kill me. It looks like something misty. Oh, it's a wraith. Oh, yeah. That's cool looking. Kevin, how do you have a little blue guy flying above you? It's a wisp. I like that. Flee, Marcus, flee. I'm... I'm like three throttles deep. <laughs> like that, you're gonna get Dave all excited. I'm definitely excited. <laughs> Dude, fuck this area, Dave. Like, all right, so we're gonna try to go backwards. Because apparently there's more sandbar in front of us. Does yep. he eventually just F off? No, I don't think he will. What am I supposed to do? Now I'm just like. Me and I Dave probably... are attempting to reverse towards you. I should probably die towards the portal, right? If you're gonna die, yeah. I guess you're better out there. We don't get stuck. Yeah, but then right, I wouldn't Dave. be able to get my stuff. We're gonna, we're gonna help him. Here we go. Yeah, are we just gonna swing swords? Oh, nice. All right. All right. T shot, Kevin. Ah. Hopefully that's not the first time he's heard. Or hopefully that is the first time he's heard that. <laughs> no, no. Kevin's been shot before. It's all right. All right. All right. Look, we have a topo that we have to somehow get to, but we're near a portal, so he could join us on this death adventure. He can, we, and we have gear for him. Kevin, are you going to get us stuck at that tree again? I'm uh, not trying to, but I'm going to jump in the water with leeches when I can't use my weapon. Yeah, what? Are you stuck again down there? No. Oh. Right, no, I just I stopped us because I was going to hit the siege. Go to the portal. Portal. That I can do. All right, Dave, I'm going to get this leech used here. Okay. What direction you want? Left or right? Portal. Oh. Well, I, there's a portal here. Yeah, there should be a bunch of them. We're at death. <laughs> portal. Well, so you're going to take the portal that's in the shack by the starting point? In the house, yeah. Yeah, and that's going to take you to a little village. And then in that village, there's going to be a like a barracks-looking house up on the hill. You want to go further to the right, Dave, or we're going to get stuck? Oh, yeah, right in front of us, right? Yeah, right where I got us stuck. Yeah. Still more, you think? I mean, I don't know if we... Like, I swear to God, we're going to have to go to, like, fucking open ocean to get around this shithole. Yeah. Okay, all right. I'm going to come back later and kill every single being in this fucking swamp. <laughs> but then I'm going to get enough stone to pave over the points where they spawn so they're just stuck for life. That's funny. I decided I don't want my house here. I'm never visit Dave's house. <laughs> well, I might have just beached myself, but that's okay. Son of a beach. 
Oh no. Actually, I, I'm good. Alright. You can just stop us here, Dave. We're gonna just start swimming to the shore so we never deal with this shit again. Every coastline is obviously death. Yeah. Alright, so yeah, if you check the portal... Topo. Yeah. It should take you to the village. There's a house up on the hill. Um, from there, there should be a, like, tower in the back of that barracks area. That's got a bunch of portals, and we're at the one named Death. Okay. Oh man, look at your fucking HP on your boat, Marcus. You have a hammer? Uh, yeah. Pull your hammer out. Not nah, your mouse over the boat. <laughs> <laughs> it was a fucking pixel. <laughs> oh. Mike, go to your map. What are you playing on, keyboard or, or uh, controller? Uh, I haven't decided yet. Keyboard, so, keep, yeah, keep keyboard, and yeah, it's so much easier to navigate through stuff. But yeah. I can but do if, both, right? Yeah. Yeah. If you hit M down in your yeah on your map, make you make yourself visible to other players. Oh, hold on, being oh shit, I just died. <laughs> Did you? You didn't get a bed yet. Outside, no. Oh, so yeah, I'm coming for you. Kevin, the portals are up here. They go to the one. Which one is that called? I need you to clarify the question. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The the portal at the very beginning when we spawn into the map. Which one is that one called? Kevor. Kevor. Yeah, I took oh. that one, and then I was walking up the hill, and then there yep. were people. But you're gonna spawn back. You're gonna spawn back at the beginning, or where are you? We'll spawn them at yeah, the beginning. Yeah, I'm the beginning. Okay. It's good. Oh, your portal's in the... Across nothing, Marcus. Nothing. Kevin, <laughs> your Kev portal is in the village, right? Yeah. That's what I was asking. Okay, sorry. Just get off the door open. Close the door. Thank you. Hey, look, he closes the door. Yeah, Marcus doesn't know how to. Oops. I well, there's a, there a guy in there, so I had to get him out. Okay, hold on. So he didn't close the door at the beginning. Didn't close the door at the beginning. All right, hold on. Here you go, Mike. Do I have to equip this stuff? Yeah. You you right click on it. I'm gonna give him um. Bronze axe and that two-handed sword, Kevin. I don't care what you give him. Give him the full set of backup gear. I've got more on no. the other server. I'm not. I'm not worried about. Don't do all that. I'm. I'm truthfully not worried about losing gear. It's. <laughs> it's fine. Seriously. Well, no, I was telling Kevin because I'm gonna go steal some of his somewhere. Oh, Mike, come with us once you're done. <laughs> I just shut the door and left. Sorry, I was. I'm used to playing with these guys. Just don't swing, don't figure out the buttons and mouse and keyboard. Yeah, don't swing the swords and okay, so inside the inside the house. Yeah, I saw, I saw, I saw you swing. Yeah. You want to come up here? I don't know the buttons. <laughs> uh, jump is spacebar. Uh, run is control. Um, what is uh, squat? No, run is control and squat. Run is shift. Squat is. Yeah. Shift and map. You'll figure the rest out. Okay, so we're up here. Kevin had like a lightning bulb. Yeah, he's a Marcus. I was seeing if he was going to shut the door. He didn't. He got sidetracked. Me? Yeah, you're yeah, I just got in here. <laughs> wow. It's like that, huh? It's yes, like that. it's like that. Marcus is over here feeling justified. It is like that. <laughs> <laughs> These motherfuckers have at you if that door is not immediately closed. Um 
Question, do you have a weapon here, Kevin? That he can have? Yeah, of course. Where's your weapon? Downstairs of the barracks. I got weapons, I'm chilling. They're on the wall. Oh, on the wall, okay, cool. Take whatever the fuck he wants. I don't have a weapon. I was gonna... Whatever you want. Okay. What is this? Is the porcupine good? One-handed mace, it's good. Okay, I don't wanna... Tried to give me, but I left there. And I can't find any more. Uh, okay. Got a shield? Yeah, alright, I'm good. How long have you been playing this for? A little bit? Um, uh, Kevin's been playing this for 20 years. Yeah, something like, like that. 16 hours straight. <laughs> I built that base over the last two days. Mike, where are you? Right here. Right here. Take this one. What is this one? Got a light you have? No, no, no. The one on the wall. Right here. Right here in front of me. Harpoon? Oh, the Thor hammer? Yeah. You have fun with it. Alright. Oh, how many weapons can you hold? A lot? Whatever's in your inventory. And you have the hot bar up there? Put them in your hot bar. Yeah, they they automatically went into that. How do I go to my inventory? Is it I? Yeah. Tab. Tab, that's what it is. Tab. Thank you. I, I hit the controller next to me. Why? Because it's right next to my finger. Because we love you. <laughs> okay, open this. We'll go through the store. Ladies first. Thanks, Kev. I appreciate that. Aw, oh, Mike. Close the door in your face. Mike, I love that sound. Thank you. Okay, just check in. <laughs> Come here. Come here. <laughs> I look back at him, see if he was going to shut the door. Yeah, I know. I know what you're doing. Pull me once, okay? Yep. So this one. Right here, we're going to go in. Hey, we're here, guys. Are we building? Is this where you want your base? Isn't that the the Black Forest is here, right? I saw like a mosquito, so are we next to the planes too? We're in the planes right now. Oh, the planes is, yeah, right here on the corner, and then you go over this way, the Black Forest. Do we need a portal? I mean, we have a portal here for those obvious reasons uh, of our death, but I, I still have the creatures portal. But um, what I guess I'm... Yeah, I'm, I'm destroying this portal when we're ready to leave. All right. A deer's coming towards you. So do we want to... Uh, do we need anything over here? I mean, I don't mind having just a house house, but... We're next. This is all on you. Yeah, it's do, whatever you want. Do we need anything? Like, I wish I could make a bridge to that over there. That'd be cool. What? Oh, uh, across this little water that we fell in and couldn't swim. Sure, just chop down a tree. What did I just do? I would, I would chop down a tree, but, um... You need an axe? Mike has the axe. Wasn't there a full set of extra... Like, my full extra inventory was in the boat. Oh... Uh, weapons, axe, pickaxe, all of it. Yeah, I didn't... We were back at the base, I was giving him stuff. I'd like to know a boat. One's way farther out than the other. The one that's farther out is the one with food on it. Tired of you leeches. That's the one. Pick up the wood, or does it go into your? If you have it in your inventory already, it will go into your. Yeah, it's going in there. Okay. Is 
Does the bane cut down trees? Is that what you're talking about or no? What do you mean the bane? Uh, is it a J Jotun bane? Yeah, that's Max. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's the that's the end game axe. Ouch. A tree just fell on me. They do that. <laughs> Trees are murderous little assholes. All right. Um. Where's my cap? Right here. Is, oh, is he in front of you guys? Okay. Skills up. Yeah. Oh, he's way down there. Here you go. I give you something. You look hungry. Thanks. Yep. I don't know. I, Missing. I kind of like this little lip of water. Be a fun entry place. I don't understand how I'm missing this guy. Hmm. Impressively. I, I don't know. Thanks. It's true, though. Every, everything you do is impressive, buddy. Are you flirting with my hoe? A little bit. Is he pounding to the ground? That's the only time you can flirt with him. Ah. Uh. Are we cutting trees out on the water now? I push it a little bit back to the shore, but it's telling me to fuck directly off. Oh, yeah, I see. I think uh, Topo is trying to kill you. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I was naming it for him. I was trying to see if it hit him. <laughs> I was trying to push that uh, log in, and then he decided to put a bigger one in front of me. It was mildly impressive how close it came. Yeah, <laughs> it was helpful. He did push the one. Oh no, that went back out. I think keyboard and mouse is easier just because of the fact that you have. I think it definitely is your hot buttons. Plus, I need to learn how to play on it anyways, so. Yeah, this is a good game to play out on. Let's see. Or she did. You guys need some wood? Yeah, I just gave Kevin a bunch of wood right here. Don't worry. Building a bridge I fell in. Oh, I thought you jumped down purposely. I was watching you. Ouch. No. Ouch. ouch. <laughs> that was an accident, I swear. Yeah, right here Nick, on the le on the left side you have wood and then you have wood on the right side too. Uh, I keep rolling down the hill, but you get what I'm doing. I, I do, I do, I appreciate it. <laughs> Excuse me. Can I put my wood on your bridge? Hey. <laughs> Only if you're naked when you ask. There you go. About as lopsided as it gets, but using shit wood is uh, not very structurally in word I can't use because my brain's failing. Uh, fern's not good. 
generic uh, wood. Uh -oh. Generic wood has a low weight, so you can only go so far. So that's why I had to connect to the other side quickly, so that I could have two ground points. Oh, uh, okay. That's why one side is higher than the other, because I was taking guesses. A good wood, the... like a redwood, hardwood, a cherry. Yeah, core. Yeah. I mean, which is technically just exactly what you're explaining. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, what uh, generic wood, fernwood, and then something else. Three different woods. Core wood. Oh uh, yeah, normal wood, core wood, and fine wood. Fine woods for furniture. Core woods better than normal wood. But the wood that Marcus gives you is the best. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get that on the everyday street. Well, there's Cross there's the your little there. bridge, Dave. So where do you want to build? Wait, have you guys tried to just walk around? Ouch! I died. Shit. Have we just tried to walk around? You all just stung me. <laughs> See, we are next to the planes. Did you die? Yeah. Uh, some random bug just came and stung me. Oh, a death mosquito. Yeah. I think I think up there in those trees to the right of this bridge would be nice. Well, pick a spot so we can put a portal down for him. Oh, yeah. We, we, I, can get, get, I can get back. No, we... No, I, I broke the portal, so... Oh. That's why I need him to pick back. a spot so we can have a portal. You can do it, Marcus. I've got faith. Oh, I'm, out of, I'm out of stamina right now. Oh. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> I'll make little stairs for you. Thanks. Dave, you have stubby legs. What was that, Mike? You should have made him get a bed first. Open. Get a what? Bed. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I should have done a bed. There's a bed upstairs in that big barracks area. I put a bunch of them. Grab which one you want. Do I need my stuff first to get the bed? Like, pick up my equipment? No, it's all going to be here. It'll be on your body where you died. Okay. <laughs> I swung at Kevin thinking he was a baddie. Uh, I think right here by the snow and the black. I like this. So like a little mix of black forest and mountain? And yeah, and the plains are right over there. I think this would be a good spot for us. Don't we need to get to the mountain someday? We do. Do you want to be further in the mountain? Let's see what's up there. Kind of uh, get the material for your home down below. Yeah, I'll just make a stairs or something. Or a pathway. How about you flatten a spot like, say, right here? Oh, that's Marcus. You must be in front of me. Okay. I'm, behind. I'm behind you. Yeah, I know, Kevin. He, he oh. came up here. Yeah, I think like right in here would be good. Oh, I hear Drake. Yep. Very easy to kill with bows. Doesn't sound like Drake. <laughs> Does it sound just random screeching sounds? Sounds the same to me. That's he has a good point. That's true. All right, and let's get a portal down. And go help him get his corpse. All right. This one that just opened? Mm -mm, no. What's it called? The... You're gonna have oh, to rename it. It'll be called the creatures. There's already gonna be one there. It's just not. It oh, does, it's not connected right. yet. Yeah. So Dave needs to come over here and name his portal. And not drop a log on his portal. I like that. Just put it there for now until we can get you a home built, and then we can move it in your home. Okay. Death, this one? No, creatures. Creatures, this one. Let's unconnect it. Unconnect it. Because we need... It's exactly the same. Yeah. C-R-E-A-T-U-R-E-S. Does it need a roof? No. Mike, I, Mike, I spelled it capital C-R-E-A-T-U-R-E-S. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's about the same. Hmm. So you had to get to death and see if it pops up. Okay, let me. I change it, still on, connect it. Oh, there it goes. There's death. death. There's got to be somewhat of a difference in the creatures then. Yeah, that's okay. I don't mind my house being called death. <laughs> a good way to warn your neighbors what they're getting into. Yep. There's a, who has a bow? Mike, come over here. Cold. Cold. Okay, this way. Run this way. No, no, he's going to need a cloak. Oh. He's not going to make it. Go back through the portal. Let's give you... Back through the portal. Go through the portal. Go through the portal. <laughs> Should I go get his cloak? So helpful. There's yeah, there should be... There might even be an extra one at the base, but I'll go down to his equipment. Okay, okay. Make room. Let's let's actually try to be quasi-intelligent about this. I don't have a hammer. Marcus, do you have a hammer on you? Do. Yeah. No? Yes, I do. Oh. Will you put, uh, like, a chest somewhere so we can drop some crap off? Alright, let's go grab his shit. Where did you die? He, d he died at the bottom of the bridge, I believe. He died at our bridge? Yeah. Uh, where do you want him? Um, Let's put him by the portal for now. Mike's getting cold. Oh, I see his body. He died at the end of the peninsula. Oh. By the workbench. I can move him later. I'm going to kill the thing that killed him. Right, I want hogs and I want rocks. Oh, I hear fuelings. Oh, and many death mosquitoes. I'm gonna guess I need stone for building, but how do I do the building with stone? Do I have to have like a uh, some type of uh, workbench to do it? You have to have a stone bench. Stone bench. Okay, cool. Stone cutter. Stone cutter. Not from The Simpsons. Yeah, there are stone cutters in The Simpsons. Mm-hmm. They're like the masons. All right, I have his gear. I'm coming back. All right. Recruiting other Dave to come play. Nice. Okay. You're telling him of your great adventures of being stung in the face by a mosquito and dying. <laughs> yep. And so going into the great. and going into the cold and almost dying. Yep. All right. I'm gonna go to sign me up in a second. We'll need to get him some gear too, I take it. Yeah, you'll need gear. I don't know. Mike heard you. Yeah. We're all we're all useless over here. Hey, you're fine. <laughs> yeah. You make the hoe at the workbench? Or no? There you go. Thank you, sir. Of course. Heaven's in heaven right now. I, I like uh building and running around Valheim. He likes having a bunch of people play. I don't blame him. I'm not used to it. I'll tell you that. This game has been solo player as far as I'm concerned. Oh, you dropped me lots of your wood. We got uh, uh, a side effect of being near you. 
Where'd you? What portals did you go through? Death. Death. That's what happens when you go to Dave's house. <laughs> How do you make a a hoe, Marcus? Since you're a pro at this. Um. Wait, I don't know. You're the oh, you're, you're the hoe. You flash your wood. He's always playing with his wood. All right. I can someone, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Uh-oh. I wasn't ready for this. Just, uh, Maybe go... Hitting me. There's wolves. Dude! Wolves are rough. I died instantaneously. I oh, did. Dave died. I died. I, yeah, I, didn't, I died too. I didn't switch to my weapon fast enough. I couldn't even see them. I wasn't paying attention. I didn't. As long as they didn't break the portal, we're fine. <laughs> That's true. That's true, yep. If they broke the fucking portal, we gotta get another boat and sail over there again. <laughs> oh, man. Wait, Kevin, did you die, too? No, I was going to get your friend gear, so I'm not there yet. Oh, good. Well... <laughs> no, and you know... Oh, fuck. Is, yeah. I didn't make a bed yet, either. Are you, and it's all cold. Now, come over here to the big base, Mike. And you, you can have a bed upstairs. We have enough beds oh, here. Fuck. All right, so your buddy that's joining, does he normally like light and fast gear, heavy gear? What's what's the generics here? Oh, I don't know. He doesn't have a preference. He'll be happy for handouts. Missed. Do you want to make him look goofy? Like, does he like using a bow and arrow? Like, what's... what's... Take guesses here. Yeah, they goofy killed, is, goofy they, is good. Uh, they killed the portal. Did they really? Oh. They, they killed the portal. Are you are you in which one? Uh, if I die like now without getting my stuff, am I going to be in trouble? Or it doesn't matter. No, no it's not like matter. that. It's not like you'll have an infinite number play. of corpses. That sucks. So they really did kill the portal. They did. <laughs> I'll bring boat stuff. Oh <laughs> uh, fuck! All right, so we have to go to the Mistlands. Uh, no, we moved both boats from there, remember? Oh, yeah, we did. <laughs> I'll, I'll bring materials for a boat. Um, I guess I need to get some clothes. At least a little bit of clothes. I'll, I'll bring at least cloaks for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> they would have cloaks. But, I mean, it, oh, yeah, it doesn't matter because the portal is broken. I was going to say, never mind, okay. What's the easiest way to make a cloak? Have the materials. <laughs> That's why I'm on the other server now. I've got all the other shit here. All right. Oh, can you transfer gear between? It's all sitting on my character. Yeah. Oh, what's this? Oh, here's one of my dead bodies. Huh. All right, let's see. Dave, the same thing happened to me. I was mining, and then all of a sudden I got attacked, and I didn't have a, a weapon. Yeah, I just... All it was was I... Uh, you said... Twice. You said, I'm not ready for this, and I was like, what is he talking about? And then <laughs> Mike blew up in front of me, and I'm like... Watch hey, watch out! What am I fighting? I don't... Hey, watch out! I, I don't mind. I'm right here next to the bed. <laughs> Thanks, Mike. Um... And Mike blew up, and I'm like, what are we fighting? I couldn't tell. And then I saw the wolves. Oh, well. Bearing too much. Yeah, I'm weak. Yeah, did you put your mic, your bed up here? No, let me get that. Yeah. What is this? Iron. Oh, this is why I'm carrying too much. Yeah, iron. Iron in this in a chest somewhere. Yeah. Somebody should check on the ground. Somebody should check the chest and see if we have enough for the boat, so I don't have to carry it all back. Uh, what are we? What do we need for a boat? Um. Just because we don't have hammers, or I guess go to workbench. Where's a workbench? Iron nails, deer hide, fine wood, and ancient. Bar. There's no way. I have iron. I got 30 iron. 
Yeah, because I don't make two trips if I need to. I don't have a hammer. Does stuff despawn if it's sitting on the ground? No. Generic materials? Yes. Oh. Yeah. The world will fine. eventually clear unused materials to save itself. After like a few minutes or what? It takes a little bit. Twenty. I do need a hoe. Remember I was trying to figure out how to make one. Okay. Uh, I don't know what are in these crates. It would have been fine if I would have left at the other place, but I left while I was in here. Yeah. Something is outside of my building. Brian, yeah, what is going on? Uh, there. Being attacked. There's animals up there. I'm gonna take this spear. What's in here, fuckface? This is not your building. No, wait. Fuck off. Harpoon, do you hold it and throw it? Alright, here. Cloak for you. Cloak for you. Dave dislikes my table. <laughs> I do. No, I was gonna. Sh should we go to bed? Here, I set some iron That's upstairs fun. if you want to carry it. Cloak for you. Let's all go to bed, and then we can do all this nonsense in the morning. I don't need that up there. Oh, we need wood. Any of these crates? Got it. Got it for all of us. Nice. <laughs> do, you, do you have? You want to go put the campfires? Light them up so we can lay down. It's letting me lay down. Must be nice. <laughs> Does that mean Kevin put down fire? Or the did you turn the fires on when you were coming, Kevin? I don't think so. Yeah, because it wouldn't let me lay down. Holy crap, is there anything... All this new stuff I haven't seen. What is this? New material, tar. Those fires, fires are up. Are they? Yeah, I put like 10 in all of these fucking things when we got here last time. Um, Dave, my bed's next to yours. Dave, you have two beds up here, dude. What the hell? I get around. Oh, this is where all the chests are, I see. I do, wait. I do have two beds. Kevin said you can't sleep at this time. How is Marcus sleeping? It's daytime. Yeah, we're, we're we're done for sleepies. Let's go. Okay. I can't carry this. Someone's gonna grab this. What is it? Iron. Uh, if you do shift, probably just overweight. I'm yeah. Weak. Here, Mike. All right. Let's go. Mike, take this on the table in front of me. I'll split it with you. Oh, that. Oh, shift splits it. Yeah. Oh, I need someone to actually carry this because I'm gonna have to go get stuff for a boat. I'm being stupid. Wait, here. I got you. Okay. I got space right now. Here is the other guy's stuff. Oh, thank you. Okay. You need iron, uh, Kevin. Is that what you said? How do no, you it's get weapons. Iron nails. Iron nails. Ancient bark. I mean, again, I might have this shit in the chest. So I, I, okay. Well, Where do you make iron? Else. Okay, never mind then. Mike, why do we have the iron? I don't know. I was gonna put it in a chest if we don't need it. Oh. I just told her I couldn't get it up to one of these chests. Okay. Yeah, let's put it in a chest then. Sorry, right. I thought we needed it for something. Yeah. Alright, no ancient bark, so I gotta run down in the swamp. So right here, Mike, is the chest in front of me has the iron when you are done doing your thing. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. You can punch me. Which chest? This is empty. Downstairs, Dave? Where are you? Yeah, downstairs. Just so we can keep it together. It's right here in front of me. Did I have 15 in there? Yeah. Really? Really? What did that what what did that pole do to you, Marcus? Hanging out. Hanging out. Downtown by yourself? Yes. 
Where's those, uh, cool guys that were freaking killing me? There's a big bear next to you. Oh, those are good guys. Those are good guys? Yeah. I, I tamed all those loxes. Uh, yeah. They're on our side now. So pick this one right here and name them. Little jeans is behind you. Little jeans. Yes. Yeah, so, so somebody <laughs> named this one Little Jeans. Who do you think named him Little Jeans? <laughs> Who do you think named him Little Jeans? Oh, that's funny. Mommy Jeans. That's funny. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. That's awesome. Where are those creatures? They like. They walk around with swords and axes, and they have green poison around them. And they're next to Kevin. Oh, what, is that, what is that button R? Did you say cougars? <laughs> same, same. <laughs> Droogers, but yeah, cougars. Oh. Same. Okay, they're running up here. Come here. Baby jeans got them. Yep. Yeah, the uh, the loxes <laughs> don't put up with a lot of shit. Look at the names of the other one. <laughs> baby, baby jeans and little jeans. Baby jeans and little jeans. I didn't name them baby jeans. Who named them baby? Jeans? <laughs> yeah, the the downside is they will eventually die if they go down on the swamp. They'll just get overwhelmed because they're never smart enough to come back up. Okay. So you'll have to hop on one and drive it up here, Kevin. Or, I mean, Mike, jump on the little jeans and bring it back up. Here comes my jeans. They're tough, but they, they're How not. How do you get smart. on them? You look at their saddle, and you sh you're able to get on. Oh. Um, oh, all right, so take it easy there. I don't know why I have a spear. Mommy oh, jeans, tamer kids. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I only had one. <laughs> That's what a lot of dudes think. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put this up. Did you put it on the wall? Let's see. Awesome. I don't need that. Okay, let's see what we got here. I'm done with this. Do I have enough now? Mike Kai was uh, here last weekend. We went to Philly. Oh, yeah? Where'd you go? Uh, have you ever heard of this uh, Irish ball called Murph's? It's uh... right off 2nd Street. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, so he teamed up with some dude from Italy. It's some dive bar Irish or some, yeah, some dive bar Irish bar, whatever. Teamed up with an Italian and they have like the best Italian food I've ever had. Nice. And we tried to go to Patty's Pub, but they were closed. <laughs> All right, what are we doing? Uh, Kevin's building a boat. Running around to get what is remains for a boat. What do you need? What do you need? Anything I can grab? Ten iron nails, some fine wood from the small base outside because we've got a bunch there. Where'd you put that iron? Make the iron nails, maybe. Oh, you gotta forge them. Yep. Take the iron to the forge. Make ten iron nails. Okay, I'll do that. And anything else, sir? Ten deer hide. Gonna be in one of these fucking chests. Um, I have eight. I was picking them up outside. Well then, go. You know, I'll bring two. Okay. If he's grabbing the iron nails, we're good on that. I guess get your. I'm move. I'm trying to move them. Get your guys out of the way. I got nine of them. You sit. Oh, no, they're hiding in here. 
That's his pen where they meet. Yeah, that, that's that's the the fuck area. Yeah, you guys. I breed pigs and loxes. Yeah, you guys don't want them to come out like that. No. Yeah, shut the door, oh, Marcus. Come on. The boar. I, there's nothing I can do. Doesn't a pig die? As long as there's two sure. pigs in there, we're fine. I don't know if there's two pigs. I'm trying to get this oh, one back gee, in, Marcus. That's hey, that right. was your fault. I'm covering you. What do you mean? I went in and out. I shut the door. You let the boar out. It's only acceptable now if you sing the song. <laughs> let the boar out. I put it back in. All right, I got tin hide. Is this? Are you down in the village? Yeah, I was grabbing fine wood. Okay, I see you're running up here now. So, where are you building this boat? In the water. I'm so, I'm so happy I asked. Oh, we, got, <laughs> we got Dave in here. What, what water? <laughs> We're just going to run down by the village. It's fine. But are you, you're, you, can't, you can't pass a scenario like that. I know. Are you doing it down by your special place where you had your other boats? No, no. Well, I mean, oh, we can do it in the mist. That's closer. No, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's cut out half this fucking trip. Good call. Okay. I was literally just going to walk down to the water and start fucking sailing like I did the other times I died. All right. Uh, gate. Yeah, I, sh I shut it for you. You're welcome. You're good. I was waiting for the other two. But we're going to repair the gate while we're here. Okay. Uh, the server's choppy now. Um, Mike, did you say Dave's here? Yeah, Dave's yeah. here. What's up, Dave? Alright, let's get him a bed and then to this portal. You can give him his gear and then we can all go get stuck on a rock somewhere. Yeah, Mike, if you want if you want to get him set up in the, like how we did with you. And then we'll we'll work on this uh, boat and portal. Um, Mr. Kevin. Yeah. How many iron? You only need ten iron nails. Oh, shit. Ten. It doesn't make. Yeah. I think it makes twenty each. I made seventy. It makes ten at a time. Hey, okay. <laughs> all good. We'll just throw the extras in a box somewhere. All right. Um. I am going to come to the miss. Hey, when I when I when I back out of the server, get back in, will it put me where where my bed is? Yes. Okay. So you want to come down to this little dock area and hand me your deer hides? Yeah. Is my yeah my server's a little choppy, so I'm gonna back out real quick. I don't have a deer trophy. Cause they threw it at you when you're standing there. Oh, can I put it on the wall? Yeah, you can. You need a hook for it. I need a hook? Jeez. Dave, let me know when you fly on that bird. Okay. Oh, you mean you mean the other Dave. This is going to be fun. Okay. <laughs> oh, Kevin, this is torture, but I'm going to do it for you, buddy. What's up? Nothing you can do. It's my server. It's really slow <laughs> and choppy. I feel like... Is it the get, like my game server? Because I don't feel any lag. Yeah, it, it, it just my connection to it. I just need to back out and get back in. But I feel like I'm in a slow motion movie. Oh no! Oh no! I don't have any weapons. Run. There you go. Okay. What do I have to do to and I'll, this server? I'll run you. By the way. All right. Uh, code and it's not letting that go through. You did the join code five three six one four four. Well, the join code's different now, because That's we had this close and real. Well, no, because we had a close and real. Oh, I don't know. It shows eight seven seven five five nine. So let me. I'll just go into Dave's thing and adjust it. I don't know eight, why it's saying, but maybe it's five five nine. Eight seven seven five five nine. You know what we should have did was when we all died, we should have went back to our save. From that point on. That's cheating. <laughs> That's cheating. And and Kevin giving us in-game weapons isn't. I know. It's not. He <laughs> it's at not least <laughs>
All right, now we just gotta wait on the nails. Oh, okay. I have the nails. Where are you guys? Through the mist, mist portal. 